Good evening, Kaizo Ironmon VOD viewers, friends of the stream. Hopefully you're all doing well. Midas Kitty is here to say hello this this evening as well. Hope you're enjoying uh, the Blue Candy VOD YouTube channel. Shouts to you watching over there. It is July 7th uh, for this VOD. And the cat has come to grace our presences today. Um, a little bit of a rough round of attempts last time, wouldn't you say? You know, you have anything to say? A little bit of a, a rough round of attempts last time. Uh, and the cat definitely agrees as he nearly takes out my wires with him. Not want to be up here anymore. Uh, let's run some ads. <clears throat> that was a treat for any Notif gang members that got to see Midas right here at the beginning. And also the VOD viewers. It's a little bit of a, a rough time last stream, but that's okay. I'm ready to bounce back this stream. Exactly what I'm going to try to do. So we can get something good. Ready to get something good today. Alright, ads are going. We are down to two moments left this month. And yeah, we've really been vibing here. So I'm ready to go again. We might hit 2,800 attempts today. 2,800 attempts. So it's going to be a lot. Okay, hopefully you're all doing well. Welcome to a Friday night stream. Happy uh, beginning of the weekend here. I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, read a lot of YouTube comments yesterday and today. It was a lot of fun. After putting out that last video. So I am uh, basically in the, in the stretch where I'm not worried about content. I am uh, the least stressed that I have been in the last week or so. Everything is feeling good right now. <laughs> this is my this is my lenient period now where I can just chill. And I think that uh, leads to some very nice streams where I can hang out with y'all. So that's what we're gonna do today. Once again, if you missed last night's stream, I did start pretty late, about an hour from now, actually. About an hour from now, I started, so um, this one's a little bit earlier, try and get back to the time that I want to be live, which is roughly around 9.30. I might change my schedule from 9 to 9.30 p.m. Central, so that's a little bit more realistic. Because I almost never go live at 9, but I, I want to. I start thinking. Here's what, here's what my schedule says. My schedule tells you when I start thinking about streaming. Not when I actually start streaming. I start thinking about streaming, and then I'm like, oh, I gotta eat this burrito that's in front of me. I had a burrito today. And then I, I gotta think about what I want to have to drink during the stream, which I only have one glass of juice. I'm probably gonna need to get more, which means I might run some ads in the middle of this stream sometime. Yep, go in the bathroom and so forth. But only once. I promise if it happens, it'll only be once, unless my tummy gets upset. Then I'll run 17 million years of ads. So that's the, that's the plan today. I am going to get more juice at some point during the stream. It's exciting. Yeah, rare mid-roll ads. <laughs> Is that moment worthy? Well, the moments don't have the ads in them. That's the problem. They don't have the ads in them. How are you supposed to know? I'd have to have, like, an ad timer on the stream. I see so many people do that, and I don't want to do that. I don't want to have an ad timer on my stream, but... Yeah, there are, uh... At the same time, there are a ton of people playing Kaizo Iron Man right now, so... If you like to watch multiple streams of Kaizo Ironmon, then uh, I'm happy to be another. I'm happy to be a, another one to uh, supplement that. Uh, the cow is here for the first 40 seconds, I think. First 40 seconds of the vod. So you have to be a part of the Notif gang to get that good content. All right, all right. Oh, or a part of the vod viewer gang. You can also be uh, sub to Blue Candy Vods on YouTube. Yay! He's actually come back, but I'm not going to be able to grab him again. But he's back over here, so... I wish he would go up on his cat tree. Guys, look at... I should probably have this open just in case I go in whiteboard mode. I have this so that we can watch Midas when he's in his cat tree, but he won't go up there anymore. He just decided to stop going up there right when I got my camera so that I could do this. It's so annoying, dude. We could have had Minus Cam all the time. He was in that cat tree 24-7. And then he stopped. God. Why do cats cat the way they cat? Also, I don't know what it is, but this looks too clean. 
My hair right now looks too clean. I look like... I look like a, a, a bitchy guy, you know what I mean? Like, I, I look like I'm ready to Z-snap in your face. Like, get the fuck out of my face. I, I don't like that. I need a little scruffy. I need a little... I need a, a little scruff, a little irregularity there. It, that was looking too fresh, too cut. I didn't like that. Okay, now we're ready to go. Alright, ads are done. Rias, welcome. First chatter. And first redemption. Very good. Congratulations. What's up, Moonbys? Hello, Jeffrey. Jeff! And Ninx as well. Welcome, welcome. The moon by his trash dove. Majin. Firewolf. Five seconds of Midas. You did. Thank you, CK. I hope so, too. Ass. Thank you for the 69 bits, Jeff. Hello, March. Discord is stuck in streamer mode. You could turn that off, you know. Unless you just are purposely having OBS open. I have streamer mode on, like, almost all of the time, too. So, um, that does get rid of the notice for me as well. Welcome, Rim. Sorry you missed it. Hello, Lloyd. What's up, Mileage? What's up, Hero Time? Welcome back. Good to see you today. Cosmo. Thank you for the good luck. Lay it out with mint. I don't know if Midas likes mint. That's an interesting one. I haven't heard that. Hello, K Zeller. He wants chat to subscribe to his only cats. Yeah, you don't want to see what's on there. He's just a little too chubby. <laughs> you don't, you want to see what's on there. It's not, it's not safe for work for sure. That cat is not... He's not got good content. I promise you that. We have to put up with his content. You don't want that. What's up, Katra? Hello, Faint Smile and Sheiker. Good to see you all. Make sure I got the fishing going today. And maybe we'll fish some more in Kaizo. So let's get started. And see what today has yet to show us. With Kaizo Ironmon and Heart Gold Soul Silver, attempt number 2789. What's up, QB? Most likely to spoil the plot of games their friends are playing through. Hello, David. What's up, Half Pace? Going for 200 mil fishing? 121st. Before Necromancy comes out. I'm getting there, guys. I'm getting there. What's up, Tangelo? Good evening. Hello, David. Yeah, RS3. Well, even an old school 200 mil is a lot, so. Alright. Spoil the plot of games. Impossible. He's kind of like a normie. He's like, yeah, have you heard about this new ending in Tears of the Kingdom? No, he's refined. Although I could see... Uh, I could see a, a snobby gentleman being a spoiler of games. And she's the one who gets spoiled. Mmm, Bulbasaur, Swalot. They're both poison types, so they're both malicious in nature. It, maybe it is Swalot. Maybe it is Smallot, because... I, I think it could be... Because he's like, mm, yes, have you heard about the... Can you see, like, it, can you see in his lips? He's like, yes, I'm just waiting to spoil this one. Mm, I'm gonna tell you about it. Overeager kid? See, I think so, too. I think so, too. Actually. So it's, it's overeager kid versus actually. Actually, the ending goes like this. See, what I think is that Bulbasaur has good intentions, and that he, he's done it before, like, he's spoiled something before, but he definitely learns the hard way. So you might be the one person that Bulbasaur spoils it, but once he learns, like, he's fine. He's fine. Once he learns, he's fine. He means well. But Swallow, yeah, Swallow is smug. I'm going Swallow. He can't help but say the locations of the ten most powerful weapons. Ah, uh, big old pile of goop. At least we got stab acid. <clears throat> Welcome, y'all. Hope you're doing well. Right here at the start of the stream here. Happy Friday, happy weekend for anybody celebrating uh, who can celebrate weekends. Hopefully you're all having a great night. Get you some pizza. 
get you some ramen. Whatever you need to have a good Friday night, treat yourselves. You deserve it. You should treat yourselves. I had a burrito today. And then Sand made me a special drink, which is what I'm drinking right now. It has, um... I think it's made of cran grape juice. And then there are also... I'm pretty sure there are Luxardo cherries in there. And maybe triple sec. I, I don't know. It's kind of just like an amalgamation of fruit in my mouth. And it's kind of cool. I like it. I'm, I'm all about the, the juice cocktails and the, the combinations. Just put a bunch of fruit in my mouth. So yeah, this is very tasty. I'm sipping on a special juice. No pep tonight as a result. I'm probably gonna have water after this. I read one too many things about kidney stones today, and I've never had one of those, and I don't know, I'm pretty sure they are, like, one of the top three most painful things. <laughs> so I really, I'm, I'm like, yeah, maybe we'll lay off the pep once in a while here. <laughs> Slacking is illegal, yeah. Need the redemption, CK Walsh. Yeah, I know, I know a lot about old school, too, just by proxy. Just by proxy, so I can talk about it, too, just not exactly what's in it. This is problematic. I can't even touch this thing. And I'm also dead. That Blossom was cracked. That thing was good, dude. That was juice out of its gourd. What the heck? <laughs> Welcome, Kaug. Hope you're doing well. An anti losing. AKA winning. <sighs> welcome, welcome. Good to see you, Joyful Pug. High temps four days in a row. Well, there are a few reasons that are contributing to that. A. The Northern Hemisphere is in summer, and the Northern Hemisphere contains most vast majority of the world's land mass. Okay. Oceans are harder to heat up than land masses are. But despite that being a thing, the recent ban on sulfur compounds in shipping fuels has caused the ocean waters to also heat up, the surface especially. So combine the two things and you have uh, good record heat. As well as when you have patterns that will cause even more of a uh, considerable warm-up over land, such as the desert southwest in the U.S. being warmed up extremely a lot. So it's probably going to continue to be some of the hottest days that the Earth has experienced on average. Okay, most likely to show up in a bullshit Indiana Jones movie. I can see it. Mmm. Weird. We're thinking bullshit post-2000 Indiana Jones. This is the the crystal jewel he, he tries to steal. Sulfur compounds insulate, aka they absorb a lot more heat. That would otherwise, uh, that would otherwise contribute to warming of the ocean. So those have been dramatically cut due to restrictions worldwide. <clears throat> What's up, Kakarot? Also, Lloyd, good to see you. And hello, Zolts. It was Pancheros. Pancheros is my pick of those three. Gotta have the cilantro lime vinaigrette. Are you kidding me? What's up, Razor? Okay. Pichu, Shellgon, Starmie. India bullshit Indiana Jones movie. I could see this. He's like the sidekick, right? The Indiana Jones sidekick or like that weird secondary character. Shell gone. This is the least likely of the three. I I, I don't know. I, I feel like this one doesn't fit in as well. Dragons maybe, but they're a little bit disconnected from Indiana Jones. And then the, this just reminds me of like stealing the jewels. But then... The, po the Pokemon is actually a jewel, and it wakes up and chases him. <laughs> the boulder trap? Okay. <laughs> yeah. So, I so yeah, like, it's a trap in a room, because it seems like a statue. 
So, like, the sidekick, the, the kind of sidekick fit. Or maybe the trap in a room. And then the boulder trap. Yeah, it actually, like, runs at you. I don't know. Maybe maybe I could see Shellgun a little more. I just feel like the dragon doesn't fit as well. Also, finalists, thank you for the 15 months. I appreciate you. Welcome back, friend. Hope you're doing well. Calm, good to see you. And Razor. Blood and Sand. What in the world is that? Ah, the Blood of Sand Master. Bourbon, Sweet, Vermouth, Cherry, Herring, and Orange Juice. Ah. I have a special drink. That's mine. What's up, Mileage? Starmy, 100%. Uh... So, here's the thing, right? This is loose. This is loose and or very specific. And this applies, because this is just like a trap in a room. I'm feeling Starmie on this one. This one makes sense to me. Well, good lord, that's a, uh, something. It's a trap. Uh, Indiana Jones. Go IJ. Help us remember. Yeah, I know, you're trying to steal the jewel, it's a trap. It makes sense, and the, it's, uh, specifically, it's the shitty post-2000 Indiana Jones movies. Per the, per the redemptions, I, I, I quote that. Also, we have the moveset that spells segs, which is great. Any, any, uh, any in immature people in chat? <laughs> oh my, let's just get more attack with our protein here. It's kind of sad, like... This is almost decent. Skun Tank has bad attack. It's probably trash. Lower BST mod needs to be perfect, and it's not, so I don't think we take the the fart there. Start making sidecars. What what exactly is that? I I did like all I like that we were able to make a case for all of those Pokemon to be in an <laughs> In an Indiana Jones movie, though. Ob Esponja. I actually watched... Dude, that brings back so many memories, actually. Bob Esponja. I actually watched... Um, I had to find some really bootleg Spanish site to to watch uh, Bob Esponja for my, for my Spanish homework in high school. I wanted to watch SpongeBob really bad to do the homework and write about it because it was like it was like paragraphs, man. We were we were in the the upper level Spanish classes by that point, so I, I had to write paragraph responses about a show that I watched and describe it essentially, and my reaction. And so I I, I had to I wanted I really wanted to do SpongeBob and I had to find some really <laughs> bootleg site with episodes. And it worked. It was worth it, dude. It was worth it. It was absolutely awesome. Well, I just remembered that was uh, that was hustle. Shout out to that hitting. Very cool and epic and poggers. That brings back. I haven't thought about Bulba Sponja for a while, <laughs> but I was just watching AI Sponge again yesterday when it was up. I don't know. I feel like that AI Sponge was a, a lot better. A, a few weeks ago. Now it's very hyper-specific in the memes that it's created, so it's kind of just like a... It's like a separated cult now, and if you don't get the memes already, then it's it's not going to be funny anymore. But I was there, and I, I do like some of them, so it's still funny. But then it gets taken down all the time. <laughs> Doesn't last too long, but this time it lasted kind of long, so I, I was watching it a little more. Shouts to AI Sponge, dude. Why am I entertained by such dumb things? I don't know! But I enjoyed it. We don't have a water stone. Yeah, 80% accuracy, 1.5 times attack. That's what Hustle does. Hope we are all doing well. Welcome. F happy Friday night. Oh, jeez. I'd rather not. I'd rather not. Well, at least it's fast. I got gunked. Okay. I'd rather not start with this, but... Let's see what the fourth move is, because wing attack is decent. Dizzy punch. Of 
course it had the stab physical attack. Why does it always do this? This is literally a repeat. This is a repeat of last night. Where I had a Chansey, but instead of Dizzy Punch, it was Facade, which is the same exact power. It was Facade Wing Attack. It's the same thing. It's the same thing. It's literally the same thing. So that means I have to do it. I mean, I would not have done this unless I had Fire Punch, Thunder Punch, Ice Punch, or a Stab Normal type move like this one. But because I have Dizzy Punch, I actually have to think about it. Uh, bah Alright, maybe. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Good enough to run until Evo? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. The best possible case for this is to Evo it on the first trainer, and then ditch it if it's shit, and then check the rest of the pivots. The only problem with that is it takes 35 minutes. So I guess we'll do it. Sure, why not? Sure, why not? Oh, did you guys watch Abney's new Flower Cup world record today? I also saw that. That was, or it was yesterday, technically, but that was dope. That was dope. We'll go Stardew Valley this time. Okay, let's start off today with a with a friend Evo. Because this one looks pretty decent. We could have good prospects here uh, with this Evo. So let's go ahead and do it. Should add like a, a thing. We'll do a pred for this one as well. Um, I'm going to give you a whole 30 minutes, actually. Because it will take us a long time. I don't feel comfortable just running this. I don't feel comfortable just running this until it evolves. Uh, over 500. So we're gonna do a friend Evo for this. 30 minutes! Go! Okay, welcome to the stream today, guys. We're gonna start with a friend Evo, apparently. On the second attempt today. Because we have something, once again, just like the Togekiss last night. That, uh, has a stab normal type move. Dizzy Punch. Same as Facade last night. And Wing Attack. Just like last night. Uh, to the T. This is not going to be a good Togekiss if it evolves into one, unfortunately, uh, because it's not a perfect moveset, but it's a start. So we're hoping for not Togekiss. But good luck if you decide to gamble in this spread. There's already 160k in it, so what do you think? <clears throat> uh, I would rather swap the special attack with the defense march but i do recognize that the speed's a little low 11 at 5 is typically the one that i don't like 12 at 5 is what i start to run so it's right there right there cocktail brand brandy triple sec lemon juice that sounds different than what um that sounds different than what razor described that's funny but yeah feel free to ask me anything guys we'll start off uh tonight chilling Start off chilling. What's up, Dusk? Relu Topichu, hope you're all doing well. Yeah, Ab Abney is doing good. I mean, the Flower Cup record has so much room to move, too. So much room to move. Favorite movie that won Best Picture at the Oscars? I don't know a single movie that has done that. I don't know anything. And I also don't watch very many movies, so... I can literally not answer that. <laughs> You find the rate setting rule silly? Well, there is a custom... Uh, there is a custom patch that just lets you insta-do it. But I don't like that. I personally do not do that. I could, but I don't. I like working for the friend Evos, and I like hosting... an alternative content while uh, we grind for it. If it is worth it. If it is indeed worth it. Thank you, Mr. Raven. Yep, I watched Phil win flat as well in the early morning. 
about 18 hours ago or however long it was. He was kind of astounded that it just happened, but sometimes it just happens. So he is already moving on to bigger, better heights. Favorite GDQ story to tell? Uh, favorite one to tell? I mean, my favorite one to tell is when I got to the hotel and uh, at SGQ 2019 and I sat in the lobby until Sand came up behind me for the first time and I got to hug him. The first time I met Sand in person was at the was at the venue. But the year before that, at SGQ 2018, I remember getting to that same hotel and it just so happened that when I got there on day zero, like almost my entire friend group was just congregated right in the front in the lobby. And when I got there and I came into the, the, the lobby, there were like 35 people who greeted me at the same time. And that was kind of cool. I was like, wow, that was a grand entrance. What the hell? I didn't even know they were there. I didn't know. So it was a nice surprise, I guess. They just all happened to be talking there. That was fun. Already fringe? I know you guys like this. What's up, kiddos? Hello, Blue Jay. You're painting a fence tomorrow the exact shade of blue I use for the emotes? Is it- Do you have, like, a bucket of paint? And what- what is the color called if it gives you a name for the color? I'm curious to hear what the- The color of the blue dog is referred to in the paint world. Referred to as. Hello, North. Welcome to Friend Evos. 30 minute pred with a decent amount in there already. And I think that ceiling is the last redemption today. Very nice job. We, it lasted 27 minutes. Do I listen to music? I don't care what genre of music a song is as long as I like it. But I will use the genre to find other songs similar to it or things that appeal to me. So generally, if I, whenever I go on a music listening spree, which I don't, you, I don't listen to music every day. Sometimes I have, you know, periods of like several months where I don't listen to music at all, really, unless it's like this on a stream. Uh, but when I do go on sprees of listening to new songs, then usually it's EDM related. Two thousand attempts in plat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the highest I've seen is 10,000 in Fire Red Leaf Green, but again, that's really not that far off from how that would convert to in this game. It's really not that far off. <clears throat> but Seelan, hope you're doing well. So generally, EDM is what I, I trended towards. And the one song that really got me into EDM was uh was essence by scrux my my best friend in high school just was playing through a playlist of songs that i mostly thought were you know dog shit at the time but i was like fine i'm hanging out with them i'm having a good time and then suddenly that one came on i was like wait a second this is kind of jamming and from there i kind of just i asked them what that song was and i and they were taken aback like you never asked what <laughs> like I just, I just don't really care and then, but I had to, I had to hear what that one was. And then I kind of just expanded from there. Over the years, and I've curated my playlist, the things that I don't listen to anymore and what I do. But my music playlist is public on my YouTube channel. You just have to find it under the playlist tab on my main channel. It's just there, it's just in there if you care. I don't really care. <laughs> So that does exist for anyone who has uh, been astute and very, uh, what, what's the word? Not snubby, but like snobby, I guess, would be one way to put it, where you actually go through all the tabs of somebody's uh, YouTube channel and Twitch channel and read all their info, info and so forth. I have a bunch of little neat tidbits for people who do that. Including uh, the, that music place. It's just a little gym if you care. You'll find it there. We might have to end this pred early. 
So that's not going to happen for a while, but we're already almost a third of the way through, and the Pred has definitely still got quite a ways to go. Kaikos Turquoise? Kaikos, huh? The Turks and Kaikos. So, so the blue dog is an islander? Is that what I'm hearing? He's got he's got the the same um, fur color as a as an islander in the the Turks and Caicos. <laughs> well, we've discovered a new a new trait today. He's as blue as the ocean over there in those islands. I forget where exactly that is. Isn't it isn't it near Venezuela or something? Where the hell is that? <laughs> yeah, water dog. Uh, the color of the ocean, which probably means he's stinky. You did nothing today? Let's go, Aldalaro. I'm proud of you. Hopefully you enjoy your weekend coming up. What's up, John? And Slug Cat's good to see you. Apologies, that sip was for you. Hope you're doing well. Any other questions y'all have? Or do you just want to talk about what you did today, which is nothing like Aldalaro? <clears throat> Thank you, Sid. Can't do squares in this house. I get stuck behind the old dude. I don't know if I've read a book in, um, like the last seven years, unfortunately. That wasn't a meteorology textbook, at least. <laughs> Unfortunate. I used to be a pretty avid reader, though. I read a lot of books until junior, senior year of high school. By that point, I had about had it with, uh, forced book reviews as a part of curriculum curricula and that kind of just set me off of reading so if you're a teacher out there i mean it's hard to teach without having uh, books to read i suppose but let it be known that's the reason i stopped kind of just started rubbing me the wrong way and i didn't enjoy it anymore oh it's near the bahamas in cuba okay so it's a little further north than what i was thinking there is uh there is an island down near venezuela though that has uh, it's Curaçao, that's what it is. I was thinking of the, the sea, the funny sea. What Pokemon can it evolve? Top 10 or uh, Munchlax are basically identical to Chansey, like you've seen before, maybe. Except you can get Blissey here and you can not get Snorlax like you can with Chansey. You, you don't have the command, unfortunately. I have not bestowed upon you the power to use that command. Yeah, I was thinking of Curaçao. And, and I, I got that mixed up with the Kaikos. The Turks and Kaikos. But I like that. Yeah, a lovely evening to y'all. <clears throat> Only certain people, aka me and Glifo, and that's it. <laughs> But I could add more people. I just forgot how to do it. Forgot how to do it. Hey, yeah, I don't think a single moderator in my chat has access to it. <laughs> I don't mean... I didn't mean to, to keep you guys from being able to do something, but... What's up, Cheer? We are wowie boying right now. I need something that has like a- I need like a friend overlay for this. I need something that's like my starting soon text, but it has like a- I'm doing a friend evo with a- with a swirly arrow that points to the friend bar to let you know where it is. <laughs> that would be kind of funny to turn on while I do one of these. I'm not gatekeeping anything. Levitate Metagross. Well, unfortunately, you have two things b backwards. We don't keep the ability, and we cannot evolve into anything that we don't share types with. I wish for a Metagross, though. So. Just need an EV Sunstone for that. That's the one exception. EV Sunstone equals 8% chance at Metagross. 
and I would like to run one of those one day. Just watching the local storm? Enjoy. I'll get storms eventually. It was actually cold up here, didn't it? It was cool. It was like 22 Celsius outside, which is 71 Fahrenheit. 71.6. So I have my sweatpants on now. <laughs> it's a sweatpants in July kind of day for me up here. Dude, we're 60% of the way there. I think. Or maybe this is still like 50. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you have to come up north uh, all the way up I-35 up here and then you'll get to you'll get to not heat. You can open your window again? Really? Over there it, over there in Germany as well? Did it get did it get cool? I mean, I know there have been, like, there have been several storms moving through Spain, but I don't know the grand scheme of, like, if there's a sweeping cold front or something. I saw a pretty interesting look to it, though. I just don't, I didn't look at the surface feature, so I don't know. I don't know. Didn't look at the obs. But if it's feeling nice over there, that's Pog. Shouts to you. It's okay, Sin. You don't need moderator privileges. Nobody in chat needs to be a moderator. All the mods are like, okay, well, unmod me. Typing unmod. What's up, Mandarite? Yep. We got piano renditions of Stardew music, which is my favorite thing to play during uh, this. Piano renditions of Pokemon uh, tracks. And also Stardew. And also Animal Crossing, sometimes we do that too. What's up, Rizzo? Hello, I'm here to be moderator. Okay, your job entails looking at Automod, catching the phrase shit fucking every five minutes, and then you click accept. In turn, you get, uh, nothing. <laughs> That's what happens to people who moderate this chat. Sorry, mods, I didn't mean to make extra work for you. I didn't mean to make, make extra work for you, but yep. <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> I wish I could show you guys that, too. It's so funny. I don't know why it does that. No matter how many times we whitelist... Bit shocking. It will always, always catch that. A Dr. Pepper a year? Well, if you come to GDQ, I guess I could buy you one. I could get, buy, purchase a pep. Maybe a strawberry pep. E. Fahrenheit, Southern Appalachia. Very good. Do the friend Evo in the house to make things go faster. Wulo, by the way, I hope you're doing well. Payment was a pizza per month? Did they actually go through with that? More than most Twitch pods get? Okay, we're not gonna have like a mutiny here, are we? Goodness. Sometimes I feel bad. I, I, li I like my mods, and I... My mods are very, uh... My, my mods are very, uh, highly selected, highly regarded. I have not a lot of moderators in my chat. You can type slash mods back, backslash, forward slash. I don't remember which one it is. What is it? Backslash? You're going back. Okay, so it's a backslash. <laughs> backslash mods. If you type that in the chat, it'll show you all my mods. You probably recognize maybe half of them. So I, I don't really have that many active mods, and I never have, never have had that many. You 
are now relaxed. Shouts to Ouroboros for now relaxing. Blue dog appreciators in chat. Hope you're doing well, Ouroboros. And Queen. Negotiate with the mod union. What are your demands? Destroying chat. What what are your demands, mod union? <laughs> You've come to a, a vote, a consensus, and have passed up your complaints and formality to the blue dog streamer. Yeah, Zircon's hype. <clears throat> We've talked about Zircon before, or boy. I know we have. I know we have. Mar Mod's main job to bully the streamer? That doesn't really happen here that much. It used to. Qvelion on that on that list was a very avid uh bullying mod. <laughs> now now it's mostly just sassiness. The mods are mostly just sassy, which is great. I've taught them well. I am after all I'm the sass master in my Discord. Make of that what you will. Of course, Orboy. I am power hungry and am petty against those who ire me. I can click ban buttons and sling shit with the best of them. The best of th Sling shit with the best of them, huh? I don't know what kind of shit my mods are slinging, but... That's an interesting prospect. Maybe they're slinging shit behind my back and there is actually a coordinated uprising. What's up, Austin? Yeah, I need dental coverage for my mods. That would be great. I don't even know if I have dental coverage. I can't remember. I can never remember that. And I have to, every time I go and I'm like, do I have this? And then I don't remember what they say. And then I probably pay anyways. That's probably bad. I should probably remember that. <laughs> Do we have blue dog stock? It's a penny. Pe it's a penny stock right now. Trust me, though, it'll it'll blow up. It'll blow up when they see the booty. They're not gonna be able to resist. So get in now. Buy buy low. Buy low, guys. Blue dog penny stock. Blue Doge coin. No, no, we're not going that way. <laughs> we're not going that route. Wowie to the moon. Sure. Dude, we're almost done. There are 10 minutes left in this pred that has managed to make its way back to 50-50. Despite there being 9 believers and 32 doubters. It has made its way back to nearly 50-50. However, if we get to the friend Evo first, if it's ready first... It'll be cut off there. So the moment it says ready, you can no longer participate in the prediction. It will be ended. Make sure you're ready for that. Doubters. Did I say the believers and doubters? Okay, yeah, whatever. The, the high BSTers. Best mon you can get is technically Togekiss, however, the moves might not be perfect for Togekiss. Because Gunk Shot and Magical Leaf are not great. If we get a physical attacker. So the best mon I would get out of this is Blissey. Second best, Porygon Z. And, uh, I think Lickalicky is... Is third. I foregore already. Porygon 2 and Lickalicky are tied... Uh, yeah. And then it goes down to Earth Ring. So we want Blissey, Porygon Z, Porygon 2, or Lickalicky. Those are definitely the top four. Togekiss would be, like, struggling, but it would at least be a start for a Togekiss if we got some gym TMs. So it's a little risky, but we're gonna go for it.
Hey, but we had a really- what you guys might not know, though, if you're just joining this and see this friend evo, what you might not know is that we did a friend evo at the end of the last stream. It was like 4 in the morning central US time. And it was a Chansey instead of a Munchlax. And that Chansey had Facade instead of Dizzy Punch, Wing Attack, and then it learned Fire Fang. And it also had Curse for physical setup. I evolved it into a Togekiss. And it was actually a modest... Not not the, na not the uh, nature, but a modest physical attacker. Um, its biggest stat was Special Defense. But its physical attack was runnable. But I got Dragon Raged on Bugsy, of course. So that one met a sad end because it was a runnable moveset. Despite the worst possible physical setup lowering my speed, it was a runnable moveset that didn't have rock coverage uh, on a, a Togekiss. It was cool, dude. It was literally cool. It was so cool. And I just, I, I had to do this friend evo right here, which we're almost done with, because the fact that I got another 70 power normal type move and wing attack again is just, the parallels are... It, out of this world it's two attempts after that one this is two attempts after that last togekiss it was 2788 that's what i ended on and now we're doing it again with almost the exact same setup it's so weird so i had to go f i have to go for it here if you want to gamble in the pred it's got like three minutes or five minutes left but we are nearly done with the d here on friend and when that says ready, the pred will end. So get your thing in now, or when it's about to say ready. Gauge it as uh, as you desire, but you don't want to miss out. What's up, casual? Hopefully that helps uh, shadow. Nah, uh, this guy's seen many a friend Evo in his time. He knows what's happening. I mean, at least, at least in my attempts, the guy knows who I am. <laughs> Blue's coming in his house again and causing a ruckus. Welcome, Gummy, though. Hope you're doing well. Good freaking luck, guys, in the prep. Halfway done with the D here. And then we will be back to our normal, regularly scheduled Kaizo Iron Monk content. Just been kind of weird. There's also a weird, like, thing following him in the house, back and forth. <laughs> I don't really know what to call Munchlax. A weird bear? Good evening, Blurt. Welcome, welcome. On the, uh, on the doubter side of the BST I see this time. Hello, Satan. Good to see you as well. Yep, we're, we're halfway through the D. Three, two-thirds of the way through the D. Good freaking luck. Can we have 500k in this bread right at the beginning of the stream? Huge. I love having no pre-rolls on my stream for the first hour. Only for like two-thirds of that hour to just be me running back and forth in the house. <laughs> what great content you don't have to watch ads for. <laughs> God, that's good. I am such a good content creator. Oh, yes. I mean, yeah, it is AMA. You guys know how it works. Functional AMA while I do this. Welcome, Fardar. Four hundred and seventy-six K in the parade, guys. Two pixels left of the D. Will we hit five hundred now? Ask me anything. AMA. Will we hit five hundred K? Fourteen to go. It is going to end the moment I see ready. Get your preds in now. Let's go, see Ray. The pixel. Come on. 
The last one always takes the longest. Thank you. 538k. All right. Let's go on up and see what we got. Are you ready? Thank you for the golf. C rate. I appreciate that. Uh, hopefully it helps you. Yeah. It's meant to help me, but hopefully it helps you too. <laughs> 69 XP. All right. Well, on this note, let's see what we get. Oops. I ruined it. It's fine. Let's see what we get. Turn the sound back on. Three, two, one. Orion 2. GG Team 2. That is a 515 BST Pokemon. Sketch! Sketch, friend Evo! Sketch, friend Evo! What? I've never seen that in my life. That's a moment. Holy crap. Team two, guys. Oh, what the heck? Toga Pichu with 163k on team one. Thank you for funding the WoW economy. You know how it works. All right. spread of all time great news this is a nasty plot mon guys we have found ourselves a nasty plot pokemon and we have sketch to learn it so let's fucking do that let's do that uh it, for now that's gonna go over gunk shot So, should we run the nasty plot Porygon 2? Or should we Evo it again? <laughs> because we could try again with the power of Sketch. If we Evo it again, we will still have Stab Dizzy Punch. We will still have Stab Dizzy Punch and Sketch. We don't have the disc. We do not have the, the dubious disc. But we can search for it. I mean, this is fine as like a nasty plot mod. It's not bad. It's not bad. It can do good things with, nas with nasty plot. In fact, this is basically what my PB and Polion look like. But, there is a prospect on the second Evo here. So we'll go into Dark Cave first. Yeah, I think both options here are equally viable. I've seen many a dubious disc in my time in the early game. Many a time. How far is PB? Probably about 9 or 10 in-game hours away. Okay, nothing in here. What's up, Moody? Yeah, I mean, it's gonna be hard to pivot off of this. It's gonna be hard to drop this at all. The, the potential here is still very large, I feel. What's up, M-Sharp? 
Congrats, team two. Hello, Antonius. I think it's several, I think it's been there for either multiple hours, but yeah, I've known about it for a while. They're actually golf ball size hail. With that. Older berry, and last item here. Happened these nuts. Yep, nasty plots, two, two stages. It's been a long time since I've seen a Smeargle. Yeah, before Sprout Tower. I mean, we're gonna look around a little bit here and see what we can find. I mean, yeah, like, using Sketch, there are- there are two moves. There are two moves that I could, uh, benefit from here. Tail Glow and Nasty Plot. So just, like, humor me a second here and be like... That is uber slow. Wow. That is super slow. With, uh, with Gyro Ball, we <laughs> scouted that thing's, uh, stats pretty well there, too. It totally fits the bullshit Indiana Jones. Is that gonna be your theme today? We can start scouting for moves, too. Since, I don't know, the dubious disc might be pretty far away. We, we might need... We might need to find Nasty Plot or Tail Glow before we go in. Air Slash! It's so tempting, guys. Also, that was a crit, wasn't it? So if that wasn't a crit, that did an enormous amount of damage. But it has no speed, so we don't care. I would like to get Quiver Dance on this. No, <laughs> I don't need Quiver Dance. We have enough speed. We have too much speed. Too much speed. Sketch friend Evo man. When you think you've seen it all. Then you have it. Uh-oh. Cool. Alright, we were gonna get Kangaskhan! <laughs> Great. Oh my god, this thing got earth power and blast burn. Hey, it's okay. When you get hit by a 225 power move, there's only so much you can do. Mm. And then, like, in the near term, we were not going to learn any special moves. That's kind of harsh. But if we had this at the start, we would have had Earth Power, Blast Burn, and then eventually Signal Beam. Kangaskhan was a nasty plot mod. Look at that. Look at this thing. Damn. <laughs> this was actually sick. What the hell? Bug Buzz and Spatial Rin, too? This thing was dope. Unlearnable Shadow Ball, though. Oof. That was actually a good Kangaskhan. <laughs> we would have been so sad, and then actually so happy. Um... Oh, that was it, though, right? What else did Munchlax learn? I mean... We definitely would have wanted Sketch there on the Friend Evo, so that was huge. Blah. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if we would have had the moves. Like, if we had Earth Power, Magical Leaf... Signal Beam, like... Mm, we didn't get Shadow Ball on this thing either. That's a little iffy. I don't know about that. I don't know... I don't know if that really does it or not. It's a tough call, honestly. Absolutely tough call. Oh, it's pure power with, huge, with a large attack stat. Okay. <laughs> Pure power. That's why I did so much with Gyro Ball. That's actually pretty wicked. Jeez. Yeah, so when I get Sketch, I'm not sure if I should just not try to scout things like that. Because, like, I was pretty bulky there. Like, the Porygon 2, I was pretty bulky there. But this thing was level 9, is just good enough to hit me with a 225 power move. Giga Impact. Guess it didn't matter. Tough call. But it's not like I was going to get through Sprout Tower very easily here. Without getting the move that I needed. I guess I what I could have done is done all the trainers first and then tried to look at the wilds. But if they didn't have it, I was doomed. Doomed desired. I would have been doomed desired. 
So it's always tough when you get sketch in the early game. I kind of hate that, honestly. Kind of sucks. It kind of sucks. Not a fan. Fair enough. The wowies were distributed. Let's try again. Pre-rolls are almost back on. By the way, guys, make sure your family, friends, dogs, and dogs' boyfriends are in the chat. Already, so they don't watch any ads. I don't want them to watch any ads. That Kangaskhan was not bad, dude. It might have been a little slow. Base 80 is kind of sus, but... It, it can get the job done. We just need Quiver Dance. There we go. We need a Quiver Dance for the Kangaskhan, actually. Alright, most likely to be Mommy Part 11. Mom? Ah, damn it. Not. Dude, this was what it was last time, too. I think Staravia is literally what we, what we picked last time, too. Okay. Fine, we'll go. Hey, at least we got we got the female Staravia. It's mom. Registeel is kind of the, the very scary anime mother figure. I've seen it before. A tale as old as time. I can't outspeed the bug and it throws a rock at my bird. Um, <laughs> this is just not really fair, man. It's early bird, too. Like, the early bird should get the bug here. Not swords dance rock slide. <laughs> Dude, we do we need do we get that Krakatoon, guys? Do we actually do we get this Krakatoon? It sucks. It's bad. It's actually it's actually incredible. Oh my god. Krakatoon run. Ice Fang. <laughs> Ice Fang, Rock Slide, Jump Kick. What is this thing trying to do? Iron Head? Can we get that moveset on, like, a good Pokemon? That would be so cool. It evolved into a Porygon 2 again, by the way. That mommy did not make it that far. It's because I kept running into the stupid bug with Sword Stance. Alright. Most likely to enjoy a fine Chianti and some Farva Beans. Some fava beans. Farva beans. I don't know what a farva bean is. Thank you, Frotato, for that one. I really don't know what to do for this one. I'm gonna rely on chat for it. <laughs> okay. It's probably curly, alright? Yeah, I have no idea. I mean, I, like, I... I have a slim understanding. Okay. I have a slim understanding. But I am not... I'm not hip here. <laughs> a chiant a fine chianti and some some farva beans <laughs> is what the redemption says uh, verbatim. Oh, it's wine. Okay. See, my mind instantly goes to chai tea. <laughs> my mind goes to chai tea instantly. Chianti? See, I don't know that. I, I don't care about knowing the pronunciations of 187 different fine wines that I have to drink with my pinky up. You know what I mean? Runnable Curlia, by the way. Let's go. You have some for a special occasion? You know what I have for a special occasion? Some grape juice. Because that shit slaps the cheeks, man. I don't need a- I don't need a fruity red. I don't need a, uh... A, a fine white wine here. I just need me some grape juice. Welcome, Ape Cranium. Ape Cranium. Cycle works for the prompt. I love that you said it. All right, getting rid of my uh, my younger brother here.
Belly drum. That will surely get the trick done. I learned about a new wine. Yeah, you have to ship it to me as well, and then I'll do a taste test on stream, and I'll tell you how much I don't like it. <laughs> that seems worth it to me, right? If two cheeks slap in the middle of a forest, but nobody is around, does it make a sound? What's up, Antoine? Hello, Treble and Ali. It's a reference from Hannibal Lecter from Silence of the Lamps. It says he's going to eat someone's brains with it. Well, as long as it's not my brains. Okay. Yo, can you use a, a the move? Use a different move. It is not using a single different move. I don't care, I'm catching it. Because it's a tentacruel, and I don't care, I like tentacruel. Okay, ready. Oh, I see. 43 HP at level 6, a uh, classic. Why is this even runnable with that? Why is this even a runnable spread with that amount of HP? This is stupid. <laughs> This is dumb, and I won't have it. Ah, uh, dude. But it's so mega little bad. Ah, <laughs> uh, buddy, why do we do this? Why do we do this challenge that we call Kaizu? Why do I do this to myself? Should I piss on it? Could piss on it. Wait. Holy fuck, that didn't do that much. Okay. Sorry. I forgot it was super effective. <laughs> hey, Dragon Rage proof. Yeah. I agree. I agree. Alright, I don't like this at all. It's badge. No good runs yet this past hour. I did a friend Evo, which took the majority of the hour. So... That's why. We had an Azumaro with 40 HP at level 5 the other day. That thing was even thicker than this tentacle. I don't know, we could run this because it would be a really funny run when in the end game we get hit by a, a, an incredibly powerful move and the HP just goes... I think that would be worth it. Okay, we saw all three mods up here. I don't want any of them. It's stressful. It's called building anticipation. That's good content. That's good content. I say we get attack order, crab hammer, and um, is it cross poison that has a high crit rate? Or is it, yeah, it's cross poison. High crit rate moves with Sniper, and focus energy on this th on this tanky tentacruel. And then we get, and then we get, um, uh, it's, and then it's incredible. Let's do that. If I could have all that, that would be kind of cool. I didn't get the level, you bitch. Damn you. What's up, 80? Show me the third mon. T the Tentacruel is going to have the time of its life here. Uh... Okay. Wait, hold. I'm paying attention. That is interesting. Even though it's a grass type that kind of... Uh, now I want to know what it has... Bulge. I need to see it. I- I- once- once you show me the calm mind, I have to know. I have to know. No, this- this can't be. We have to find it. 
Yes. I've been streaming on this website for six years now, which is why I have the, the broadcaster personality. And I, do, I can do what I do. <laughs> I have the experience from over here. I used to tweet out my streams all the time. But then there were too many normies. There were too many of them. All right, torment. Rolling kick. It's really trying to set up. That's why. That's why it's trying to set up. It has no special attack. At all. That should have killed me. Double boosted uh, psychic there. 180 power move. It did 40. Did 20. So it has literally six special attack. Which is hilarious. So that thing sucks. That thing is cheeks. I should have died there, but I didn't. Only because that has zero special attack. Only high crit rate in the Legends Arceus? Okay. Oh yeah, I know it's- I, I wanted to attack order. Oh sorry, I could have showed you that. You didn't have to go through that. You didn't have to go through that process. I could have been like, yeah, I know it's not. Yeah, it's not. I'll show you in the tracker. <laughs> but then I- I didn't do that. I appreciate you spending your time. It means a lot. <laughs> Upgrade. Grip. Where's the dubious disc? What's up, Andrew? I should probably go heal here. Probably go heal. Yeah, on this, uh, right now, for the past year on this channel, I've been doing Kaizo Ironmon. Exclamation point Kaizo, I'll tell you all about that. Information you assert? Ah, uh, you've, you've asserted such a thing? Well, and the tracker is not an end-all, be-all resource for the accuracy of these things that we're talking about, to be fair. Alright, this thing again. Let's piss on it. That's not, um, that's not a good response. Right. Yeah, that, that was just the electric fence disguised as a, as a bunny. Mandela effect. I mean, it makes sense that it would have a high crit rate, right? Cross poison is literally, you know, X poison, X scissor, X poison. It would make you think, but no, it's the bees that have the high crit rate. It is the bees that have the high crit rate. All right, we're looking for the last Pokemon here on this route. Be level eight when we find it. We'll be level 8. Okay, bye. Love that. Wigglytuff is always going to have Roar, by the way. It learns no moves, so that was actually a good thing to know. Good thing to know. So you can't set up on Wigglytuff ever, because it'll just roar you out. It'll just go roar. Please show me the last one. I know Gleefo. It has so much HP. I'm just checking. I'm just looking... Oh, that actually has decent speed, okay. It's not runnable, though. The low punny's not... Not runnable. Dude! Where is the thing? No fishing pivots yet. Just a friend Devo with another 70 power normal type move and wing attack. Which is literally the same thing I did last night. Literally the same thing I did last night. It turned it into a Togekiss last night. It was great. This one turned into a Porygon 2 that then learned that was a nasty plot setup. And it learned sketch. And then I died while looking for moves. I should have done the trainers first. What's wrong with getting roared? 
You switch back. Well, if you're a setup mon, then your setup goes away. You lose your stat boosts if you get roared out. Phoebus, thank you for wasting my time. Appreciate that. The classic. How are you doing, Log Leaf? Uh, I think it's two in the morning over there. Hopefully it's going well. Wiggly tough with seeing. That's a. Uh, isn't that just typical? Yeah, I don't want to die with this damn thing because I my speed's so low. Looking at the rest of these pivots is really dangerous because I could just dedge. I could just dedge, man. But I want to see what there is. This is the thing that I am going to try to run. Unless there is a better Pokemon, and we have seven more Pokemon to look at right now. And if I could hold that Black Sludge, I could just win right now. Black Sludge on this high of HP poison type would be so busted. I can't even tell you how busted that is. It's busted. So I could just pivot to I could just pivot to an ultimate run and win right now. What do you guys think about that? Ultimate run? <laughs> ultimate run, hold the black sludge. Show me your briefs, weatherman. I don't think that's what that reward is for. But that might be a good usage of 2,500 wowies. Yeah, it heals only poison types. Show me your briefs, weatherman. I don't think I can do that. Okay. I... How does this keep happening? How does this keep happening? What? How does this keep happening? He's literally just spamming Dark Void. He doesn't even care to do anything else. Really? It, that just happened to me like seven times in the last hundred attempts. Catch him? Only if he has... Well, he can't have compound ice because he has bad dreams. Hmm. Jesus, I'm dead. Oh my god. Uh. All right, here's our spread for our tentacruel. Looks great, right, guys? Huge tentacruel. We're gonna learn acupressure next. <laughs> and uh, for our physical attacking moves, we had high jump kick and takedown. <laughs> it's good. It's good that tail glow showed up. So was low punny a tail glow mon? Because it might be. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe it is. Not really. Did it learn it? Uh, Mammoth Swine. Anyways. Next attempt. Yeah, Faulkner Tail Glow Seed. That's why you look, ma'am. What if you get a Pokemon, then you run into Faulkner Tail Glow? Why you look? Check the Salamence for fun. No. <laughs> okay, I got it. I got it, Gleefo. I don't know where you live. Maybe you said it on stream happenstance while I've been there. I'm supposed to remember where. All 157,000 of my YouTube subscribers live, otherwise they hate me. Yeah, the captions do pretty good stuff. What's up, Crimson Fox? Um, the next one we have is right. That's illegal. Okay, lantern. Tail glow. See, guys? You just have to play your cards right, and then everything works out. Any good runs lately? Yeah, several, actually. Um, and all of them are on the Blue Candy VODs channel on YouTube, exclamation point VODs in the chat. They're all up there, although they're nestled in my, my unedited VODs that I upload there now. Except for the thumbnail. Thumbnails are edited. 
They're all nestled in there. Alright, so let me bring up... You use Celsius over there in Brasil, correct? I mean, yeah, I mean, ev everywhere that is in the U.S. or Liberia, I think, uses Celsius. <laughs> I just have to know so I can say the right temperatures here. Ooh. Looks like a nice period coming up. I'm seeing some goodies here for Gleefa. Lewis of Fahrenheit, well, I'm about to give you a lesson. Need a lesson, Slowpoke? Alright, let me see. I gotta get to the rival fight here. The next couple days in Sao Paulo. Uh, which I don't actually know how to pronounce that, but hopefully that was good enough are actually pretty dang good. From what I can tell, it's going to be a, a great couple of days to spend in the metro there. With tomorrow at about 26 Celsius for the daytime high. And then the next day is more like 22 to 23 Celsius. Warms up a bit for the a few days after that, but it looks like you get an active weather period coming through there. That might have a slight chance for rain on Thursday. Looks like it's going to be pretty windy, though. That's the most unusual thing I see with that weather. Probably a cold front that moves through there. It's pretty windy. Then after that, for the rest of that week into next weekend, it might be pretty on the, uh, the brisk side. The cool side. <clears throat> might be on the cool side for a while. Please use false swipe again. That is not false swipe. Okay, good. Some of those days into next weekend actually look like they're going to be, um... They're gonna be below 20 Celsius for a couple days. So enjoy those if you like that sort of temperature. Let's try it here. Should we tail glow one more time? I don't know if this thing can kill me. Yeah, yeah, you're you're solidly in uh, the middle of winter time here, so looks like you will get a winter time cold front that actually manages to make it over there. Joy, if you crisp days. That's kind of funny. Blizzard and hail that did one damage. <laughs> doesn't this doesn't this increase my evasion? Dude, what? Start missing, even though Blizzard I does Blizzard how does it work in the hail? How does it work? Does it apply the Blizzard never miss condition? First, or does it set its accuracy to 100 and then it's 75 because I have snow cloak? Okay, so it is bypassed. Thank you for the crit. Uh, nice W, by the way, guys. We just won against another legendary today. Psychic? Why am I kind of liking this thing? <laughs> Damn it. Stupid ass nature. Give me the inverse nature, man. Why does this keep happening to me? Give me the inverse nature. Yeah, the most interesting thing I see coming up for Sao Paulo is, uh, is that cold front on this coming Thursday sometime. And, uh, actually today, basically the weather I had today up here in Minnesota was really, really cool for um, the summertime we're, that we're in right now. It's really, really on the cool side for that. It was only 22 Celsius today. And that's what you're going to get after tomorrow. So on, uh, on Sunday. 
Weather app recommendation? I don't have a solid way to recommend a weather app to anybody who doesn't know how to interpret what it's putting out and uh, essentially use its data to your advantage, not as gospel. Because if you don't know really how to interpret what it's saying and essentially... <laughs> Essentially just like why it's saying what it's saying. It's hard to really make good use out of weather apps And that's why so many people are frustrated with them because they just I mean if, if they don't know they just Take it at face value and that's just never going to be the the right thing to do in the weather world It just doesn't work like that Which is unrealistic that's unrealistic unrealistic to dis to ask of anybody to just know how it works, of course. So don't get me wrong, I, re I recognize that that's a stupid thing to say, but at the same time, there is a reason why I'm saying it. Um, do I care? Should I just get this thing? It's bad, but, uh... Oh, you right on the Tropic of Capricorn? No, I didn't know that, actually. But I do know exactly where that is. 23.15... South latitude. Pretty sure it's 23.1. Did I foregore? Oh, maybe that's fine. I don't know. <clears throat> but, I mean, the weather app that I always use to do those, uh, the smaller scale briefings there are, is what, is weather underground. Wonderground. That's what I use. I like that app, I always, I always have. But it's because I know that it isn't gospel. <laughs> And it's a, it's a part of the, the weather channel, too, which a lot of people have started to not like, and that's totally valid. But that's what I... I've always appreciated their services. I use them forever. I use them for a long time. My favorite weather app is, is actually diagnosing atmospheric data based on model output. That's my weather app. But I do use Wonderground, yeah. That's the one I use the most. So here's the here's the here's the low down on this dog. At the moment, it's basically putting out two thirds of the expected power against 20 defense that I would use here. So I think it has like 13 or 14 attack, maybe a little bit more than that. Anywhere from 13 to 15 is what I would guess its attack stat to be, which is not usable without setup at level five. It is not a runnable Pokemon without setup with that sort of attack. So, it's a risk. We have Magical Leaf and Psychic, which is not a good... It, I mean, it's not a bad, but it's not amazing. No HP on the Lantern. Like, I don't see this as being a particularly good Pokemon. Because we have a useless attack stat. So, I'm not enamored with the Lantern either. That's the thing here, is I don't really like the lantern that much either because i and my my philosophy it does include lucario on always takes i always i always do take lucario so i do want to copium this despite the the lantern and what we have so far it's just i don't think the lantern is really going to work out Lucario's an always take. In fact, I mean, we're just by, you know, just by logic here, we're we're getting 65 more BST. If we put that 65 BST in Lantern Special Attack here, it might be runnable. <laughs> All right, we made a good decision. Let's see what we can do. If this gets set up, oh boy, are we in a good spot? <laughs> Because this thing getting set up would kind of dominate. This thing gets D dance, I think it's over. So yeah, uh, if you get if you give me D dance on this mod, we might actually win. So let's give that a shot. D dance, come on, man. We might actually win. There is one move that will turn this run into a winning run. Of 
Mirage is not the move. <laughs> I don't even know if I should take this. Genuinely do not know if I should take that. Bitch. Oh my god, this guy's juicing me right now. Ah. No! <laughs> Get this guy out of here. Oh, what a piece of shit. <laughs> Yeah, any any recoil move is perfect for this. We need recoil moves and we need um and we need D-dance. I think that's just the best case. Brick break recoil move D-dance. Yeah? Yeah. Speed is quartered, not halved. But yes, beyond that, that is correct. All right, let's send this damn dog. It's not every day you get a Magic Guard Lucario with a a runnable spread for D-Dance or Sword Stance. Sword Stance a little bit less so due to Destiny Bond. <laughs> you shit. Of course, Cloyster is runnable. Extra Sensory! That's not gonna do it, Chief. Extra sensory is not gonna do it. I wanna know where Cloyster is. Out 35, okay. And jump kick since you can't crash? Really? Magic guard prevents jump kick damage? I thought we went over this before. What's up, hey hi, by the way? And just say the thing. I thought we went over this before. I don't remember. I don't remember what we resulted in, or what we came up with. It's really good XP. Oops, no, not attack down, you idiot. Not attack down, you dummy. Defense down. Is Wisp illegal? No. Why not use it on Armaldo? I guess I could have. It's just 75 accuracy. I just was trying to take it down, really. It probably would have been better past a certain point, but I wasn't really concerned with that. We still have potions from the beginning, so nothing was really wrong there. It wasn't doing anything to me. I was not concerned. Kakara, I hope you're doing well. It does prevent damage? Okay. It's, again, it's these really niche things, because I don't think anything with Magic Guard Vanilla actually learns Jump Kick. <laughs> I don't know if that is a... I don't know if that's a thing or not. Barrage is so mega low bad, but technically Pin Missile is worse than it. Jump Kick is actually good now. We are going to try this run out. It is, in my opinion, Magic Guard, depending on the Pokemon, is either the best or the second best ability. Depending on the Pokemon. And uh, the other ability that it competes with is Poison Heal. For being the best one. You move. Fight! Good lord, we have the trio, Psychic, Ghost, and Dark. Uh, I mean, Barrage is so mega a little bad. I'm just gonna keep Will-O-Wisp in case. I don't know. I genuinely don't want Barrage. Let's go for the crit here. 
Why poison heal? <laughs> Buddy. <laughs> Why poison heal? Why poison heal, huh? Is this a good wowie? It's certainly a wowie of all time. If it gets D-Dance, we might win. That is where we're at with this wowie. Some of it is obvious? Yeah. Well, the rest of it is that it's still obvious. <laughs> yes, I did. I did, Guifu. I saw how it died. Worry Seed into ridiculous Thunder Punch. I knew it would get to Kanto, man. The moment you get Fly on on a Poison Heelmon, yeah, it's just... You are so good to go. No coverage on this. You're so good to go. Is Psycho got contact? Why do I always forget this one? Psycho Cut is not contact. I should probably use that as much as possible. But I am the I'm the biggest uh, poison heal advocate, so you won't find any poison heal hate on this uh, on this here stream. What did I just say, gamer? What did I just say? Use Psycho Cut, you dingbat. Oh no. No coverage. Fine, Will-O-Wisp. Bitch, Will-O-Wisp. Ugh, this sucks. Go for the flinch. Buddy, please stop doing that. If you could... I also have a Hyper Potion. Alright, well that was really annoying. Yeah, I- there are- you're right, you're absolutely right. There are a lot of people who have different opinions on Poison Heal. But me, I recognize it as literally one of the- It is literally the best ability in the game if you know how to use it. If you can get past uh, Chuck as well. No, yeah, it's it, my opinion is that it's the best one. <laughs> that is mine. And yeah, right? Like, hey, hi, saying you love to watch Krause's run because the strategy is actually spectacular. It's a freaking wonderful strategy. It's the most fun. It's the most um, reconstructing of a run. Like, there are, there are no other abilities that would make you decide to do a gym early, so to speak. And, like, it's just super cool to have those things. And a lot of people say it should be... Not a lot, but... No, nobody says it should be banned. Not many people say that, at least. Nobody that matters. <laughs> um, but some... There are people who just won't use it because they think it's too cheesy. But I don't care about the cheesiness. I think it's genuinely exciting. I think it's exciting, it's innovative, and it's refreshing, too, to run, uh, to run Poison Heal. Anyways, do we take Skull Bash? I honestly don't know. Will-O-Wisps is kinda... I mean, Skull Bash for, like, Conch Crow, right? Dark types are kinda sucky right now, so... I'll take it for those. PBS! We have the PBS... ...move set here. Yeah, and it's net. While it is really interestingly cheesy in the way it is, it's not a free win. Otherwise, I would have won a long time ago with my poison yield Jolteon. Let's get a defense boost and not paralyzed boost. Thank you for this fight. Psycho Cut or Bite, I'm not going to one-shot this thing, so I kind of want the flinch. This is really going for the special. I see. Oh, this will be a problem for a little bit.
that was fun. Brother, get the heck out of the way. The fake Chloe. Cool. Let's go to Faulkner. It was volleyball of, uh, of psychic energy there. Yeah, I like that. All right, guys, here's your pred. Will I beat Falk? Exactly, yeah. I, I find it very funny if someone is adamantly against Poison Heal, but then goes back and... But anytime they're asked about the challenge, they say the main point is to have fun and enjoy the ride. Well, that's the exact point of why I like Poison Heal, because it's actually, I think, the most fun ability to run. The prospects of it are so exciting and refreshing. And, like, strategy heavy. I think it's great. They say it's bad content, but actually, they just don't know how to make content. Sixty-five thirty-five on this. Most say it's strat heavy? Yeah, there- I don't really- I don't have a list of people who are against it, but I've heard it. How do you poison yourself? On a wild. I I do uh, catch and release on wilds. Once you find one that can do it, especially if it's poison gas or something like that, that makes it really easy. That's good. The recycle run with Dustnor was really fun too. I would definitely do that again, yeah. And then we we just got to use natural gift for the first time too, and that was that was genuinely awesome. I forgot about the blue shard. That kind of sucks, but we should be okay. We'll be all right. There are gatekeepers in the Nuzlocke community. Oh man, I'm so happy I decided to join the Kaizo Iron Monkey. I have a move for that, bitch. <laughs> I have a move for this. Oh no. We still didn't have vanilla aftermath. We're good. Fun is when you force others to follow your rules. Fun is when you are... When you have control. <laughs> Alright, the good news is uh, with our above average level here, we're going to be out of one hit KO level range from Faulkner's Ace, which has happened to me a couple times. So I always like B21 on this fight. Or at least after the first mod. Double cock. You killed my son. Prepare to die. Uh oh. Uh, mildly problematic. That isn't. You don't just get, like, freedom from confusion with Magic Guard, do you? Do you always get second turn snap out? What is it with confusion and magic guard? I can't remember. Thanks for the setup, man, by the way. Appreciate that. Chatting! Yeah, it doesn't do anything. <gasps> I told you guys! <laughs> I told you I like to be a higher level. God damn it, I called that shit again, man. How many fucking times? Fuck off. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you thought you could get me with your nonsense. That doesn't happen. Try to use sheer cold. But we were a higher level. Mach punch, please give me that. Guys, ready the unables. Unable. Uh, I just overwrote Tail Glow. How does it feel? Unable. Faulkner is a W, though. But did we really win everything in the end? Did we really win? Mach Punch would have been genuinely great, actually, to have, though. Kind of sucks. 
But it doesn't matter until we get set up. If we don't have set up, frick mock punch. Frick it. We want we don't need it. We need D dance. No, actually I kinda wanted that. <laughs> Protein though. Bam. I got an HP out of that and no attack. I love that. Yeah, Mach Punch is priority physical fighting. It's kind of one of the perfect moves for this Pokemon. Unless we get D-Dance, then we don't really need priority. I'd rather have Brick Break at that point. We could just learn the best move in the game. Max Ether, Blue Shard, Max Ether. <laughs> wow. What a what a uh what a smash here. What a rock smash. Max level of Eevee, imagine the prospects. We're gonna have to look at that later. That's kinda incredible. What did we have for it? Moonstone! We could have gotten Tyranitar. I knew I had one thing. So we could have gotten T-Tar. We'll have to see what the Moonstone was. Although, I mean, really, we could just pivot to it and get any stone coming up. If it were runnable. Legal T-Tar. We'll see if it was. Favorite Pokemon casual playthrough? Black 2 was my favorite. And also... Diamond because I did not have platinum. Those were my those were my favorite casual playthroughs. Gen four and five, and I had a genuinely good time with Gen nine as well, in the exploration phase. That was very fun, very fun. Welcome, Chakra. We will continue on this Lucario. Just thinking about it, man, if we get that move, if we get that one setup move, it could happen. Right here, right now. Are you ready? Dark types are so bad for me. T-tar chances are about 8%, so yeah, pretty good. That was a crit. They are pretty solid, yeah. Black white too, yeah. That was it was really solid. Oh god, it was just so good. The story is perfect. Gameplay was ideal. And the and again, the external things that it had that worked with it, like the um, Pokemon online thing. The Dream World. The Dream World online, like everything that worked with it was just so freaking good. And then part of my, part of the reason why I like Gen 4 so much is that I, I had a great time, Cockaberry by the way, nice. I had a great time playing it and experiencing it all the way through. And then also using an action replay after that. My first, uh, as a, a young child, my first delves into the, the modding, the modding scene. For me using an action replay with Gen 4 game, Gen 4 Pokemon games. And I, I loved all of the things that you could just get to that were, you know, accessible in game, but only with, with like event things or silly glitches and stuff like that. Like, I just had a, I had a great time. I had a great time just doing that. Nope, TM list is correct. It is in order as well. Ah, it's missing 69. You're actually correct on that one. You're actually correct on that one. I haven't seen TM69 in a while, though. What's up, Thab? You liking the Magic Guard Doggo? You know what I pivoted off of? This lantern right here. With Tail Glow. Uh, Rock Smash overwrote Tail Glow. Oh my gosh, Cockaberry and Choppleberry? Okay. We have berry coverage, I love this. 
Yeah, action replay. It was it was actually just so much fun. Yeah, reach shaman in the the way you're not supposed to. Like, I don't know. I just really like that as a as a preteen. I had the time of my life doing that. It was great. I I really liked it. What do I think of Gen Five? It is my second favorite. Gen 4 is only superior to Gen 5 in total because it includes Heart Gold Soul Silver. If it were just Diamond Pearl Platinum on its own, then I think Gen 5 has the edge for me. Because it also has Heart Gold Soul Silver, and I grew up with Gen 2, and Gold was my very first game I ever played as a wee lad, it has a special place for me. Yeah, just all the all the things. It was just fun to create those things. Any hacked Pokemon, any any anything. Oh, we're gonna do this again. Oh, great. This game likes to throw these out at me. This is incredible XP, by the way. 26 and a fourth. That's so good. Very nice. Yeah, it was just so much fun to create hacked Pokemon and walk through walls and all this stuff and explore what the game had in ways that you weren't supposed to. It, and that was all happening before, you know, it was really a, a centralized thing where you could trade Pokemon to everybody else in mass. Like, it was before that was such an emphasis in the game. You could just enjoy that sort of second experience of the of the game on your own. Now, if you hack Pokemon into a game, it's just this whole big deluge of shit that you give to other people or battle other people with, and that was never the focus earlier on. It is the mirror match seed. I also had to not take an Eevee, a ma almost max level Eevee rock smash pivot, because I have a moonstone. Could have gotten a T-Tar as well. History Dungeon was awesome, too. Best spinoff is Mystery Dungeon, despite there being a lot of really good spinoffs. No, I haven't played Arceus, or Legends Arceus. But I've seen enough of it to have a general understanding. Virtually all top players that play on cartridge gen their teams. Yeah, I'm like... Yeah, it's a, it's a tough competition be between Stadium Games, Coliseum XD Gale, and Mystery Dungeon. There's just so many good ones. Coverage. Slow start, though. What do we really gain from that interaction? This thing is tanky. Please, sir, can I ask for a dragon dance? Oh, we got a Thunderstone, too, for, our, for the Eevee pivot. So that was accessible. We definitely could have taken Eevee to, uh, to that Thunderstone right there. So we'll, we'll check the Thunderstone. I swear if it's Metagross, I'm gonna end somebody in chat. Somebody is going to perish. We did not just pick up the Sunstone, too. Now we have three things to check. Somebody will perish if that is illegal Metagross. Watch yourselves. Oh, yeah, what the fuck? What the shiza is this thing? Okay, good. I'm not a fan of this Reggie Gigas. That is going to be an issue. <laughs> That's gonna be an issue in the late game. Okay, we got a soda pop for our troubles. I volunteer as tribute. 
You hear yourself? <laughs> Hope you're all doing well this fine Friday night, though, by the way. Nuz Lurker, Sfeel Leave. Yep. Sfeel Leaving is ongoing due to harsh opinions. And that's fine, that's valid. Spiel leave if you must. Okay, that's pretty tanky too. Pretty tanky there. So excited to learn Dragon Dance on my Lu on my Lucario here. Guys, I didn't make it past Bugsy at all last stream. Not a single time. <laughs> that would be kind of nice if I could make it past Bugsy. I'm not even sure when the last time I even made it to the mid-game was. When did that even happen? When did we even do that? I don't know. I'd like to make it there. <laughs> because the Charizard didn't make it there. The Charizard just got devastated by uh, Whitney's gym, it didn't, and it didn't even get anywhere. Yeah, definitely a few days. Damn it, this thing sucks. Yeah, the Infernate made it to Morty, I was thinking about that too. Magic Guard, bitch! Let's go! Magic Guard. Stop! Why is it so bad? Ah, uh, this is a D dance right here. Let's start with a D. Shit! Double team on Magic Guard? Is that kind of sussy? Are we liking that? Nah. I don't think we're liking that that much. I don't know. I don't think we're liking that. Like, it's okay, but I don't know. I don't know if we're liking that. It's on Magic Guard, though. It's the only time where it makes sense to have double team, I guess. I don't need both Bite and Shadow Punch, but also, like, lowered accuracy is annoying. And there is Gallade and Metacham. So. Is having a never miss move and Galley and Metacham coverage better than potentially double team setup? Also, keep in mind, actually, you know what? I can't do that. I need PP as much as possible if I never do get set up because I'm not going to be able to kill anything. That's going to be the problem here. I'm not going to be able to kill anything. I need as much PP as I can get. So I need to, I have to have that in mind too. That's, that's the only thing that would keep me away from taking double team over Shadow Punch. And I think it might actually end up mattering. Yeah, this is definitely viable. This is definitely viable for the Elite Four. I agree with that. I agree with that. I mean, I do have a lot, 60 total without Shadow Punch, but I don't know if that's enough. <laughs> I have two max ethers too, so like it started up, and I could, I could, uh, you know, use those. I, I almost never use max ethers anyways. Uh, but it's just a little weird. It's a little odd. I'd, like, I'd rather get rid of Skull Bash, but then Dark Types are my problem. I wish we had Brick Break. <laughs> mock Punch! Damn it, where's my Mock Punch? Oh, dang it. Um. Hmm. Shoot. I do... 
I, I like it, but I don't really see myself using it. Except on more on Morty, Chuck, Jasmine, Price, Archer, Claire, and the E4. And before that, like I'd like to have more moves. I don't know. I don't know. I I do like it for hard scale. I'll definitely at least have it for the hard scale. It'd be a consideration. Rival two. I think we could test it on that, yeah. Yeah, that's a tough choice, actually. I don't know. Uh... There are no never-miss moves that are s super effective on me, right? Except... Vital Throw. <laughs> hmm. You think double team gives me a win condition? I think Magic Guard in general gives me a win condition. Hmm, okay. Aura Sphere? Right. Special, I was attacking at the special move. I only thought of Swift. Okay. Still a little bit concerned about the PP, but two max ethers already. If I ever get in a sticky situation, we at least have an out. We have an out. I don't know why that was... That was a really hard decision for some reason. Contemplating all the ups and downs of it. Oh, you're faster this whole time? Jeez, it's four times your level and speed. What the heck? It's way too much. <laughs> you suck. Gladius sucks. Does that get me to 30? No. So close. Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl moveset. I'm a fan. Okay. Let's try it against the rival. As long as we don't get outsped by the first mod, I think it'll be actually okay. Why? <laughs> Dude, that's a 85 act move. Oh my god. I don't know. I don't. I don't think I like it very much, guys. Max evasion and bone club, like 85. Like I don't like that very much. <laughs> Doesn't seem to be working very well. about this thing. What was this? This was, um, we had the Lantern, equal attack and, or equal defense and special defense. It was seemingly really bad special attack. It might be, like, all speed and HP, maybe? Okay, it has no speed either. It's probably just that. Did false swipe as well. So its attack might be equal. Just 
destroyed. Why no miss? Yan doesn't miss, I guess. Yan doesn't miss. Most annoying moves imaginable for a magic guard with max evasion. Yeah. Like what? Come on, make it make it make sense, man. Why can't I just have a good time here with my setup? Oh my gosh. Alright. Bugsy Pred's open. What do you guys think? One minute to gamble. Not very long. Will this beat Bugsy? Good luck. Welcome back, Sebastian. Had an interesting day so far today. Am I going to win? Yes. Yeah, mind reader yawn. <laughs> Wonder if the AI was like working off of me having max evasion. Just using using those moves. Could hold those berries. I don't know if I want to hold anything right now. I mean, Oron might be okay. But I don't want to get plucked here. I don't want to get plucked. Uh, aftermath, no. Okay. Good. I don't like this Lucario, man. Nothing's touching me at all. <laughs> Nothing can touch me. Uh, we're kind of just vibing here while everything tries to throw hits at me, and then it all—it's all trash. I love it. What's up, Zack? I'm a bike. Cool. Oh my goodness, what the heck? What the heck? I'm not making another video right now, I just made one yesterday. This is not a f not a good uh, friend of the stream here. What? Just kidding. It's uh, something. A legendary of all time. What the heck is that? Uh, that wasn't even a crit. I don't really like it when that happens. That scares me. That really does scare me. I, I'm not a fan. How many legends will there be? Yes! Let's go, Darkrai. Me first? <laughs> okay, I mean... Dude, why is this going so well? I don't understand. Am I level 31 already? This is above average level pace, but not by too much. 32 on Bugsy is typical. Alright, should we try to set up? It's the ace, though. Oh, Slugma Balls? Yeah, we go for it. Slugma Balls, man. Try me. No. No. <laughs> no. That has accuracy, too. Why couldn't you just miss? I don't like that very much. God. This guy's out to get me. Holy shit, give me a crit. What the fuck, man? <laughs> Slug my balls, man. That's unreal. Well, now I don't feel so good. 
now we're in the shit. Now we're in the shitter, man. This is not good anymore. Jeez. That was a crit, too. Leave me alone. The fuck's wrong with you? All right, 150 defense. I'm going to soda pop, I think. Maybe regular pot here. It's a low, low level month. Surely it doesn't have coverage. You burn me, I swear. Try to get rid of that. How come nothing is missed? You know I have an evasion up, right? Oh my god. Follow you to your grave. I'm about to lose it. Ah, piss. Really, dude? I think it's gonna nasty plot, but like... I'm not gonna be able to kill it, and after that, I don't want it to hit me with nasty plot shockwave, man. Uh, I have to burn the soda pop already, just to be safe. I really don't feel good about this, but I don't like this Pokemon. And there's still another after it. I don't see another way out of that. We could go for the bite here. Oh, Christ. It's not looking good, guys. I should probably double team. Well, it's not a shockwave, I won't miss! <laughs> no! <laughs> No. <laughs> this is so dumb. Please flinch. Probably another nasty player. Well. This isn't gonna kill. I don't think it will. It has to. This has to crit, or this has to flinch. And I just, yeah, I don't see it happening. I do have a choice. I can go for a 30% flinch or a 12.5% crit. <laughs> uh, and th so I would be in. The it, the thing is like. Does this have a chance at ranging? I don't know. I don't know if it does. I can't tell. Maybe it does. Maybe it does. I can't really tell. I'm not looking closely enough because I'm already mentally checked out. I don't think it does, right? Bugsy's already used his first potion. He'll use... Uh, he only has one. So, no. No, bite does... Bite, bite crit? Yes, bite crit would kill. The 36% chance to stay in with bite, I guess, with either a crit or a... Those things aren't exclusive, though, so that's not how statistics work, by the way. But I've pressed bite five times and none of them have flinched. What if it has inner focus? What if it has inner focus? Heal? I don't have heals. Yeah, it's inner focus. I gotta... I don't know. This won't kill, will it? I should have been spamming Psycho Cut. I would have lived if I did that. I would have lived if I spammed Psycho Cut here. We messed up.
I want this, I want this to kill. But I don't think it will. It won't. Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't kill. I know it doesn't. It doesn't kill. Ah! Yes! <laughs> oh my god, dude. Ah, uh, what the fuck. Get out of here, man. Please don't kill me. Hawk on. Why are you so good? Why are you so thick? Oh my god. <laughs> That was by the clutches of a Bugsy win. I don't know if I've had one that close in a while. Goodness gracious, somehow the Believers came through there. Oh my god. All my resources gone. Dude, Worry Seed didn't even matter there. Giga Drain. It didn't even matter. It didn't even matter that I got Worry Seed. Nothing, nothing there changed that. And we were right, Psycho Cut was not going to kill there. It was not even a... I don't even think it was a range. I did have a... Sp oh, a special defense drop? Well, that magic guard doesn't stop that. Does it? It's not shield dust. Shield dust would stop that. Shield dust would prevent Luster Purge from dropping special defense. Magic guard wouldn't. Oh, okay. Well, we did it. Now we have nothing. What's next? Can we build back up from zero? I like Root Ball's suggestion, by the way, of just coping with the evolutions that we saw. That That's a good suggestion. Also, Personberry, really good for this. We have two red shards to turn in. 2 a.m. Slurpee. Yo, enjoy that shit. There's my boyfriend, very good. What's up, Silian? Shinies. Your nads. Well, hopefully they can, uh... Hopefully they can, uh, roam free once again. Go to bed grandpa moment. We all have them. Even I have had them. Because I almost pressed Psycho Cut there on the, on the cloister, and that would have been it. Hey guys, we got nothing! Yay! No, I don't want paralysis because my speed's quartered. And I can't be poisoned either, so there's no there's no status I can really carry through. Uh, because poison's the one you want to carry through. There isn't really one I can carry through. Alright, new move. D-dance for my troubles, please. Hypnosis. I've been hypnotized into coping in this run. <laughs> hypnotized into believing this run's any good. Ah! Uh. Not like we're fast? Yeah, but we don't want to be that slow. Mid speed is goaded. Mid speed is awesome. We don't need to lose our mid-speed. More of dicks. Yeah, a few tanky boys out there. Welcome, PD. Coverage. Yep, but I can't get poisoned, so I guess I'll keep coping. These freaking dark types are killing me. You mean defense raised? You don't get to just do that. 
Bro, how is he getting these procs? He just got the steel wing proc two times. 10% chance. Explain. Liberals, explain. Goodness. Yep, no, uh, no poison for me. What a gym fight, dude. Frick. All right, everything's fine with the world again. We got it back. Yay, we're all good. We got more PP heals. We have two red shards to turn in. That's more PP. I keep using repels, even though I don't need to. I'm just repelling all the pests away from me. All the bad items. All right, leftovers. We win, guys. GG. Kaizo's over. Very cool. Rindo reduces super effective grass type damage, which doesn't do anything for me. We go to the arcade. We'll go to the arcade if we make it to part three of Radio Tower. So that you can listen to the jammer while you uh, gamble in the prediction for that. So, a long way away, but if we make it there, then yes. Yes, if we make it there. Gambit time? It's always gambit time with these runs. We got a lot of trainer grinding to do before Whitney. Blue dog versus blue dog. That one has nothing. Blue dog friend of the stream. Okay. Love that. So you could actually use them. It wouldn't be bad, would it? I mean, the Chillon Berry. The Chillin Berry. It's kind of like that. But that's about it. Please give me freaking Brick Break, I beg of you. E Dance Brick Break right here. Right here, right now. Gen 4 Psychic Legend moment. Really freaking good XP. That's what I'll say about that. We are juiced on the XP right now. Still going strong. That has pretty decent special attack. I'm gonna leave it as plus mark just in case. Nope, I don't have th I don't have threads. No threads account for me. That's a the Enigma Berry March, and it get actually restores your HP too. That's a good one. I like using the Enigma Berry, and it would be good on this, too. I'm with the three types. That'd be perfect. Would use the Enigma Berry if I could get one. Enigma Balls, yeah. No! Get this... Dude, Slugma is the worst Pokemon of this run so far. Genuinely. Slugma was the- is the enemy of this run. Uh, yeah, we marked that as plus. It lived, so... Probably low enough that... Dude, I haven't hit myself a single time with confusion. <laughs> That's five one rolls now. We had one earlier, and there's four more right there. That was single time. 
Uh, no coverage. That was a crit. Uh oh, it's starting to get stinky again. Ha ha! No swirling magma damage. Eat it. Alright, keep doing that. Don't do that. Okay, that thing sucked. D dance. Overheat. I mean. No. It's like not better than double team. It's a move that I would only use in isolation, which is nice. It's not better than double team, I think. Ugh. It is steel. Yeah, that's the only reason I'm pausing on it. But I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth it. Too jank! <laughs> we were so intent on using it, we overwrote Shadow Punch for it. Now it's too jank, huh, chat? Chat just wants to ruin my run constantly. Yeah, look at that. Classic chatting. No. I'm not taking it. Magneton Schmagneton, dude. Who cares about dumb old Magneton? It's not even gonna show up past level 30. Hey, if anything, this is a jank run. We don't have a win condition right now. We just don't. We don't have D-Dance. When we get D-Dance, we have a win condition. If we get Swords Dance, we also do. But until then, we don't have one. We don't have one. So, Overheat does not give me that win condition. <laughs> Think of it that way. Swimmer Kirby. Thank you. Yeah, double team is set up. No better mon to use it on than one with magic guard. gonna give this setup a whirl here. And cope for something better. Slugma would have done Worry Seed no matter what I did there. It would have Worry Seeded no matter what, because I couldn't one-shot it. Unless I crit it. That was the only case. Okay. Bye. back. We had a soda pop and a hyper potion. We used those. Now we have them back, basically. I wish I had two of each, though. <laughs> that would be better.
Yes, leftovers are illegal. If they were legal, there would be at least 30 times the number of wins. And also, nobody would care about the challenge, because it'd be too easy. What's up, water dragons? Thick Club Marowak? What? <laughs> what is that, Zap? Oh, that's a custom class! That was a redemption? <laughs> it got auto-modded as a redemption? That's so funny. I thought Zap was just coming into the chat just calling me a little bitch ass, but it was actually a, cl a trainer class redemption. It didn't show me that. I was like, are you feeling feisty today? Uh, this is too many, that is too many characters, by the way. That's 13. So we will have to do some refining. Would you like to put bitch ass as one word? Yep, count the spaces, my friend. I would never. <laughs> <laughs> it's just funny. <laughs> it gets automated again. What the heck is this? It got automated again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is going well. All right, I have added it. Thank you for the redemption. Yeah, the automat does not show it as a redemption. It's just like, hey, why are you being mean? <laughs> Oh, spicy late night chat. Yeah, leftovers are legal in survival, Ironmon, as long as you sacrifice one of your moves for cut, the TM cut. It's kind of interesting, but also it's just like, all right, well, cool. I don't have any interest in playing survival. It can be fun and like, full of anticipation sometimes, but I don't really like the style as much as Kaizo. Okay. My previous predictions say Faulkner, Bugs Bugsy, Faulkner, 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 Bugsy, Friend Evo, Faulkner, Bugsy. So we have to make a new one for Whitney. And that just goes to show how I have not made it anywhere in eight quadrillion years. But the Whitney Pred's open now. What do you think, guys? What do you think? Will we beat Whitney? Gamba. Where you are? The sooner- the soonest you'll see that is when there is a thunderstorm during the day when you actually get a monsoon- when the monsoon actually moves in. Then you'll see it. Congratulations. 65-35, huh? Two-thirds, one-third? Oh, wow. Should be interesting. 100k in the pot, huh? Critical hit. The moon is the backside of the sun. I can confirm that your anus is a uh, is um. It's doing something. I don't know what it's doing though.
I don't want this. Please do not do this. Thank you. You just had to get a little bit of damage in, didn't you? You piece of shit. Oh no, now we have to do this. Yeah, knocked out chatting. Wonderful, dude. Oh, the rare transition. <laughs> the rare transition, guys. Here we go. Oh my god, it's a pain in the ass, too. What? Other... I don't even have, like, anything. Sure. <laughs> Rip? Yeah, we're fine. No dropped frames, actually, this time. Very good. The seed's not being kind to me right now. Well. Okay. Let's get rid of it. Cool. That was 12 damage. <laughs> I don't know if it was a friend of the stream. Still had a 50% chance to burn me, which would have halved my attack. Despite not doing any damage, it would have been pretty freaking bad. Lazy mer. Wow, I did 51 HP to it, of course. Classic, man. It's fine. I'm happy that Whitney healed that one. Lucky dick. Another one. Whitney has two super potions, too, so I did less than 50 damage there. That's terrible XP. Absolute trash XP. Now we are right on average pace again. We went from above average to average. Levers. Rapid dicks. Is this going to be another Lucario that has no attack and makes it all the way to the Elite Four? All the way to Lance, which is my Lucario PB? And that Lucario had like 130 special attack at level 75 or 77 or 8, whatever it was. Looks like it. This Lucario will actually have a higher attack stat than that one did when it makes it to Lance. Because that will definitely happen. Defense is OP. Actually, I think it's proof that Magic Guard is OP. More than defense. Defense? Very good. Enjoy the coffee. 
What's up, Crank? Guess what time it is, chat? It's time for you to guess what the Sudowoodo will be randomized into, what Pokemon it will be randomized into. Because if you get it right, get a gift sub, put your guesses in chat now. Good luck. Great balls, chat. What's up, Drawn? Yeah, this is this is pretty slow. I run mid-speed mods all the time. This is a little bit below most of those. It's kind of in line with some of them, but it's on the slow side. Looking at two times the level in speed to be like mid-speed and just under that. We're at 1.7. Which is not that fast. Right, there it is right there. I am going to go the canes. I'm going Blaziken. As my guess. And the chat has Pidgey, Skitty, Keck, Leon, Hound, Doom, Machop, Kulava, Cacturn, Bonsly, Sfeel, Torkoal, Weasel, Ho, Blastoise, Squirtle, Chingling, Cradley, Rayquaza, Flaffy, Clefairy, Meryl, Lapras, Kulava, Snorlax, Stantler, Hound, Doom, Sentret, Shaman, Charizard, Charmander, Muck, Bulbasaur, Miss Mage, Squagsire, Muck, Slowpoke, Slowpoke, Krikatoon, Caterpie, Why Not, Skitty, Growlithe, Growlithe, Lucario, Slowpoke, Chinchow, Weasel. <laughs> oh, that was sad. Uh... That was a lot in one breath. Rosalia, Munchlax, Shadow, Vulpix, Weezing, Chansey, Misprime, Cricket, Top, Progly, Ludicolo, Meowth, Poliwhirl, Diglett. Badoo. And yeah. Manaphy! No legend music? Bruh. Where's my legend music? Manaphy was the answer. People don't usually guess the legends, so I don't think that was a W. No W? Lucario's a good guess. How many times have we had the doppelganger pseudo-udo? I think it was only once, right? I think I've had it once, but I don't remember. Yeah, we did see Fiona recently as well. Or Fiona. Fiona from Shrek. Dude, this thing had horn drill. Thrawn, thank you for the prime sub! It hasn't even shown up in the chat yet. That's how fast that alert was. I appreciate that. Welcome, welcome. Enjoy the blue dog emotes. Add free viewing for a month. You can always also join the Discord if you are subbed or anybody else in chat got a gift sub recently. Feel free to join in there. So that means you get to use blue dogs everywhere. Everywhere. The blue dog is everywhere. Appreciate that. Yeah, Petra Berry is so useful. Always love running a steel or poison type mon and getting to that part of the story. We like Vespaquin. Let's have more of those. Thank you, Drawn. Much appreciate anyone who seeks it out. Seeks me out over here just to do that. I do what I can. Uh. The good news is that this doesn't matter that much. Transform is not scary in this run. Can't try me, bitch. It's not scary until I set up with uh, Dragon Dance, I guess. Then it would be kind of scary, but not too bad. There you go. But if they use Transform like while I'm setting up, it's really not that bad. It's gonna cost me a little bit of heals if it's like Will in the Elite Four. It'll cost me a heal to get through that mess, but it's 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 manageable. Whereas Transform has killed several of my runs out right before. This time it won't do that. <laughs> ah, yeah. 
Yep, my activity checker on, on Discord. I do keep that going despite the fact that it also... It also attracts the, the sillies sometimes because it's a... Because it is a, a, visib a visibility thing in that Discord. Sometimes there's a little bit of the sillies. I play a lot of games you like? Oh, a lot of them, huh? Well, tell me more about that. Welcome Rasta and Octopus, by the way. Appreciate everybody who sent in a guest. Shouts to the Lurkers tonight. Hope you're all doing wonderfully. And enjoying the start of your weekend. What's up, Mulaney? Early for you. Morning tea, morning coffee. What's going on? Soda pop, let's go. Now we have two of them wit. We could have had three, though. <laughs> the Shuka Bear, we have one of each weakness. Let's go. <laughs> How is that even real? I'm pulling shit. Next speed is so good, too. What the heck? Kicking booty. Kicking at names and taking butt. What's up, Ionic? Yeah, Jen, or, uh, Imposter's gonna suck balls. I'm, I'm gonna do Imposter Lock, where it's only on Ditto. Kind of like Underguard on Shedinja. But that still doesn't really help. <laughs> you know what I mean? It, it's gonna help a little bit, because instead of being on like 10 Pokemon, or 5 to 10, or 2 to 10, it'll be on 1. But it's still bad. Uh, it's not universal, is what I'll say. Some people run without imposter lock, some people with. So it begins to deviate into... Um, abstract. Ambiguous. There's, it's not universal. That's the thing that sucks about it. This thing is thick. I wish it was, but yeah, people are allowed to do whichever one they want. I kind of don't like that this much. What's up, Shaddy? Good to see you back. There's Del Caddy. <laughs> Somebody guessed that. This thing is thick. She has a heal. What? You had Force Bomb this whole time? God, that's a disgusting mod. Are they really that bad, Root? I haven't really looked at any conversation on it in a while, so... But I, I know it was split, but I didn't think it was... I didn't think it was heated at all. <laughs> Take it to the grave. So I play Mario Animal Crossing Love Nintendo I'm working on New Horizons and the newest Yoshi game. I don't know which Yoshi game is the newest one. I don't remember. Interesting though. Yeah, besides this challenge run that I'm doing right now, all all of everything else I do on Twitch is speedrunning. That's my profession. My hobby. Alright, here comes another move. Crafted World. Isn't that like a few years old? Burger Bunker. What? <laughs> I don't know if I should do this or Skull Bash here, honestly. Probably Skull Bash, you idiot. You idiot gamer. All right, new move. Defog. Still coping. Red dog, you got it top. I'll get right on that. Sorry, best I can do is gold dog for a, a shiny. But then we'll have blue and yellow and we just need red. Raise desk up. You got it, Justin. Thank you. See you guys soon. Arcanine? Yeah, that's true. Stand up. Very good. Hello again. In fact, I have a camera preset for this. Boop. No. No shiny Labmon at all. 
I've never had a shiny Labmon. I've seen four shinies in my Kaizo career here. Booba. Never a shiny Labmon. Still haven't seen one. Somehow. And I mean, when you think about it, we've been through almost, um, 8,400 Lab Pokemon, because I look at all three every time. Yo, Morty's TM is trash. Okay, good. Yeah, never seen a shiny lab on. Join Discord? Appreciate that. My shiny odds must be broken. It's a 1 out of 8,192. We're a little bit past odds, that doesn't mean I'm... Doesn't mean it's impossible for me to not have seen one. Oh, rods. I know, Python. There's a new Coke flight. Why is there so much soda news? Soda! Ultimate Coke? What does that even mean? Ah, uh, this piece of crap has worry seed too. Won't have it forever though. Obamna? Yeah. A hundred thousand Pokemon? I don't know. Most I mean most of them holy shit, I just got fucked. What the heck? I just got destroyed. That guy destroyed me. Ultimate with a tinge of coke. I like it. I will buy it right now. Dude, Parafusion every time! Except... Or Parafusion. Yeah, Parafusion. Except I can't be Parad, so it's just... Slow Fusion. Slow j fusion <laughs> Put the cane back in the coke? Now that's the right thought presses right there. That's the question. League of Legends. Oh. Grudge these nuts. I want to stay standing up for a little bit. You're not joking. Oh. You're not joking. It tastes like Legi League of Legends. So, doesn't League of Legends taste like sweaty gamers? Like, what? what is that supposed to taste like? Calypso. Oh, Lemonade. I was like... Is that a character in League of Legends? Sorry, I don't know anything about that game. <laughs> um, so we know the rival's ace is Azelf. I'm gonna do the lighthouse first. Dun, 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 dun. Salt, sadness, and lost hope. This didn't have too much D. Maybe two shot? Yeah, nice. Yeah, nice. It has a huge amount of attack, though. Okay. Can trainers be shiny? No. I don't think so. That, I mean, like, mo that's why most of the things I've seen are on trainers. So I figured that's why I, I haven't seen shinies very much. It makes sense to me, at least. This limited edition flavor made in co-creation with Riot Games takes the recognizable and adds the electrifying taste of plus XP. What? Force Palm is really bad here. Please keep doing that. No. Okay. That could have been bad. You're so trash! Oh god! Is it over? Is it over? That doesn't happen. That's why I don't do Lighthouse first, guys. I don't do Lighthouse first because of that. If I did Lighthouse second, I would have won. 
So everybody who says do lighthouse before burn tower, <gasps> suck a fat one. <laughs> I would have won. These gamers don't know how to route their Kaizo Ironmon, man. Alright, okay, what did we get? Comet Punch and Hydro Pump. Seed Bomb was okay. Unlearnable Swords Dance from Misty. Yay! Let's go. Uh, great. Alright, well, I died to a Quilava. I've been around 4 to 7 out of 10. Oh, okay. In ratings. Oops. Morty. Cheer cock. Ah, uh, whatever, man. I mean, th it was it, there was no setup. It was copium. It was cope. This whole time, it was cope, man. Dude, look at this Blaziken. What the heck is this thing? <laughs> with with double kick. This Nitto Queen was so mega little bad. Yeah, I mean, this seed isn't really worth looking at. We never found setup. We found Seed Bomb. Oh yeah, Eevee. That's what we needed to look at. We were gonna look at the Eeveelutions. I kind of wasn't uh, on board that until we found something that changed our status. Because right now we didn't have a win condition. Alright, Eevee. So we had the Moon, Thunder, and Sunstones accessible. Moon was Houndoom. Alright, let's see what we would have had. So level 22 is when we got Earth Power. We would have had that. Uh, so we would have had Attack Order, Earth Power, Dragon Rush, Metal Claw. Okay. Maybe Stab Swift. I mean, I wouldn't keep Swift, probably. Houndoom a Special Attacker, Low Speed. Nope. Alakazam? Nope. It has Tail Glow, though, but Post Radio Tower. And Thunder. Elect a Buzz. Terrible. Electorizer, which we found immediately after that, right? Yeah, that was the next item. We found an Electorizer. Alright, next attempt. When is it ever any good? When is it ever any good, guys? Thank you, Rius. Sounds like you're gonna get a good night's sleep here, early on. I appreciate that. Thanks for being here once again. Huge. What's up, Sandstorm? Yeah, that was just a sad seed. Oh, I did have a Dawnstone? Yes, that does work for Eevee as well. Did you see what it was, though? I was scrolling through it, so... It probably showed up for a split second. I saw Typhlosion. Hot Jinx Summer? I don't think so. <laughs> Blue merch? Have I considered that? We've literally been talking about that. The last few streams. Do you need me to bring it up again? What we're considering? Post wowie booty. And then imagine that as a mouse pad. That and the blue dog plush, that would be the only merch I would want to really do. Yep, wowie booty mouse pad. Ever typoed my name after starting a new seed? 
Oh yeah, plenty of times. I just don't bother correcting it. I've been blood before. Keeping it fresh on my mind? Yeah, I'm still thinking about it. A titty mouse pad? Yeah. I don't want mugs and stickers and... <laughs> wow, clear body doing work there. I want mugs and stickers and shirts everywhere. Like, shirts are really good, but only if they're, like, unique. Like a pocket. I like the pocket fox. It's so cool. I love that from Ray's the pocket fox, because that's, like, a unique thing. I don't just want a shirt with one of my emotes on it front and center. I want it to be creative. I don't I don't just want a bunch of blase merch. That's why I've not done anything yet with that. I would want it nice and and fun and special. So a plush, that's special. It's unique. I like that stuff. Hey Rays, I was just showing off my shirt. Hello, Rays Fire Raiders. Wow, post this emote. Look at that. Ray C. Thanks for the raid. Raids fire. I'm stuck in hell once again. Playing this. I'm also fishing in RuneScape at the same time. Sometimes I fish in this game too. Middle. Okay. Holy crap, you gave me a banger again. How do you do that? How do you just do that? Wish you could swap the special defense and attack though. Uh, W. Fishing levels? I'm 118 in RS3 right now. Are you still playing RS3 or did you go old school? <laughs> Finally go old school. No. Thank you though, Race. Hope the uh, rest of your- did you- did you planet coast? Did you PB? Another vanilla potion, nice. We're playing Kaizo Ironmon here, guys, for anybody curious. Uh, exclamation point Kaiser will tell you all about it. It's a complex challenge run that I have bashed my head against the wall for one year now, basically. Uh, doing the same thing over and over in this game. And still have not- I have not won. I have not won, so... Here I am, doing the thing again. You did PB, let's go. And you did coast, let's go. That sounds like a successful stream. Yeah, I'm trying to 120 all in RS3 before Necromancy comes out. I'm close. I'm getting there. Almost there. I think I might just barely be able to do it. And then I will immediately lose 120 all. <laughs> Ain't that something. And Laura, thank you for the 11 months. Sorry, I was getting to that. Give me some time. Give me a little time. I need time to talk. Laura Pringle's not letting me talk. Opinion on beef min. I don't know what a beef min is. Is that like beef ramen, but the but it's not raw. It's it's just min. There, I did it. I don't know. I don't need my min to be beefy because I am demisexual. I love a person for who they are, and not their beef. <laughs> Who they are and our connection. Thank you, Danny, for a two gifting a tier two sub to bounce. I appreciate that too. I used to like you for your beef. Yep, and then you stopped playing Toadstool Tour. Sucks to suck. Not me exposing Sand. No, guys, Sand is the most jacked man you'll ever meet. You just don't know it. He remains modest. <laughs> Men in beef patty costumes? Is is that is, is that what you guys were talking about? Is that what you guys were talking about? Why? Why were you talking about this? That's what I should uh, ask you. Enjoy the emotes, Bows. Tier 2 gets you um, several more. I don't even remember what my tier 2 emotes are. <laughs> Uh, I believe... What does- what do you even get in Tier 2? Does anybody even know that? I don't even know what you get in Tier 2. I'm sorry, I'm a bad streamer, but nobody ever subs in Tier 2 or 3. This is a new thing for me.
Thank you for the follows. If you don't know me, I do mod for Rays, so I'll ban you right now. I'm going to ban all of you right now. Sucks to suck. What's up, back? The tier 2 emote? Is it just the wolf? Should have five of them. I don't know, like, I want to run this Walrin. And I probably will. I'm just looking right now. I'm perusing my wares here. Wolf Pet G Blue Pride. Okay, so you get a bunch of different colored wowies. That's actually pretty good. You get a you get a gold one, a blue one, and a rainbow wowie. That's kinda good. That's kinda worth ten dollars a month. Tier two tier two subscribers. Look at those. Look at those guys right there. I banned the triathlon world record holder from Ray's chat. Isn't it destiny? Guys, before you got here, we were talking about the, the new Coke flavor. Have you heard about it? Raise fire. You heard about the new Coke flavor. It's called Ultimate. And it, it tastes like... According to them, it tastes like... Whoa, that's kind of good. What the heck? Possible attack up. It tastes like um uh, XP gains. Because it's... Because they partnered with Riot Games. For League of Legends. I don't know what XP gains taste like. That is not a meme. I am being totally serious with you right now. That is actually what they said. According to my chat. Okay. Is this a mixed attacker? Yeah, yeah kind of is. Mm, I don't know if I like this. This is going to be my HM friend. I think this guy sucks. HM friend. He sucks, he sucks, he sucks, he sucks. Get in the ball. Okay. Oh, he's so bad. Oh my god, he's not bad. What the heck is this thing? This thing is like a... This thing is a Giga Chad. Mixed attacker, no defenses. Yeah, I don't know what it tastes like. It's just plus XP flavor, yeah. What is happening? Ugh. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Danny, thank you for tier 2 subbing. 18 months. That's a year and a half. Thank you, Danny. That's huge. And thank you for gifting 5 on top of that. Wow. Enjoy your gifts, friends. Blue dogs in the chat, please. I cannot bone this thing. Blue dogs in the chat. Spam them. Get those blue dogs everywhere. Dude, my number one emote used across the platform of Twitch because they tell you that now. Wowie booty was used in was used like 2600 times in the last 30 days in other people's twitch chats They tell you that now dude, it's it's actually stacked <laughs> They tell you all this this good stuff. I'm gonna run this wall right. Let's run this thing They, they tell you all those stats now So shout out to all the people who are posting the blue dog ass everywhere else And then also, Wowie Boy is used a lot. It's the second most. Everybody loves the Wowie Boy. That that that's just genuine goodness. And then the third most is Wowie L. That's a that's an unexpected one. Poison cock. Okay, I hate that. A lot of there's a, there are a few people who are avid Wowie L users. Yo, ice body though. What do you mean levitate? Get the hell out of here. There's so much happening in this battle. What's up, Osomo? Thank you for the good luck. Hopefully you're doing well. This weekend, how's it going? Yeah, Twitch tells you how those e Twitch tells you how your emotes are used across the, the site now, which is pretty dope. 
bailed out by Ice Body. I, I healed like 4 HP off of it. It's not that good. It's not that amazing. Wow, yes, yeah. You can see why it gets used. Initially, I was really hoping... I don't know, I, I, I kind of still like the idea of having more of a directly Keck emote. Rain Dance, that's not helpful. <laughs> I was going for kind of the Keck W, but I, I redid it as the the Laughing Wolf meme. That's what Wowie L is based on, the, the Laughing Wolf meme. But it kind of turned more into like a... I don't know, it's more trolly than the Laughing Wolf. If you haven't seen that before, just look up three laughing wolves. It's an old it's an old school image. Old school meme. It's based off the one on the right. And it kinda it, and it definitely works. It like captures the emotion that I was going after. With a little bit more uh, subtleties as well. A little bit more usage. It doesn't really function as a wow, Razel, I'm laughing at this. It's so funny. It's more like a <laughs> you sit you you really think that, huh? <laughs> Very good stuff. You're old. You don't need sleep. Stop lying. Uh, but have a good night, dude. I'm gonna die. I need moves. Own it. This is actually not good. These moves suck. I am getting destroyed right now. I need the attack and special defense to switch, please. I will do so, Danny. Yes, I've seen that, Bows. That's the that's the classic dancing one, right? This is so bad. How is that thing such a giga chonker? Speaking of Swift, there you go, Espeon. Yeah, everybody in their 30s in chat is just like, yeah, we're on, we're on your side, Danny. We're on your side. We get you, man. Get a, get a hold of yourselves. Get a grip. Yeah, thank goodness Colosseum is over. Colosseum is over. Crab rave emoji. What's up, Jet Ray? If you find a mon with 600 or more BST in the wild, no, you may not catch it. If you evolve into it, you may use it. Only then. If and only if. If and only if. Oh my gosh, please. Can I just live? Why is it so hard to live? Good grief, everything is so tanky. Yeah, I really... In order for this run to be good, I really just need to swap the attack and special defense and then... So we're really... We're really gonna suffer here until I get bulk up. <laughs> bulk up, then we're okay. No bulk up, Sag. Alright, new move. Ugh! Now I can't hit Drift Bloom, but I don't care. I don't I don't know about this one yet. It's not looking too good. So Drift Blim Schmiff Blim. Will we beat Faulkner? Right open now. That's not bad. It's pretty bad. It's pretty not good. It's pretty not great. But, will I beat the gym? The pred is open. It is yours to decide. My chances against Drifflim have probably gone up. Yes, I agree. I agree. What if it has gravity? Then we can bone... Then we can use bone ring.
I'm sorry to anybody in their 30s. Maybe I offended too many people. Don't worry, I have chronic pain everywhere on my body except for my head. So, I understand being in pain. Do not worry about that. I get it. <laughs> you don't have to explain to me. That's why I'm memeing. The shit eating memo? Yep. Yep. I think that's why some people like it. Yo, this move's really good, guys. I think instead of Mega Kick, it's Mega Cock. Dude, what is this thing? Hello? Pain of loneliness? Said everywhere except my head. What? How are you living? That is one thick dog. Uh. Uh. It's over. What in the frick balls was that? What uh was that? Are you serious? Da, 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 trump card, cross poison, caster ass, and tail glow. Tail glow, guys, we did it! Unbelievable! We were gonna win. It was right here. Yes. Nothing like my 11 special attack tail glow. There was not a single more uh, cross poison, that was it. And scratch. It's over. Tentacruel? This also got Tail Glow. Earth Power, Hyper Voice, Shock Wave, Tail Glow. Mud Shot. Uh, anyways, I'll show you guys Arceus so you can laugh at me and the doubters can be like, hell yeah. And then we'll go to the next one. Here is uh, Arceus for your viewing pleasure. Wonderful. Yep, Arceus. On to the next. We are rapidly approaching 2,800 attempts. Nobody in Heart Gold, Soul Silver, Kaizo Ironmon has reached 3,000 attempts yet. So we are rapidly approaching the first. 3k threshold. You can't evolve into legends or slacking. It's impossible. You can evolve into several 600 BST mons, though, but it's unlikely. I think Danny went to bed, Seal. Thank you for 100 bits. Awesome. Mo Appreciate it. Bitch at their partner about not cleaning the dishes. Just kidding. We run the penguin. Payout? Yes. Actually, Doubter's getting somewhat of a decent payout. Very nice. Congratulations. Alright. It's, uh, it's a penguin. I mean, wouldn't this also be the redemption, too? Awesome, wouldn't you agree? Like, maybe Steelix is more, more angry. Because it can't even do the dishes. So, like, it needs somebody to help it do the dishes. <laughs> I, yeah, it's kind of between Empoleon and Steelix. Oh my god. What is happening? Okay. Hmm. 
I don't need no friend evos. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, alright, alright. Let's see. As long as we don't die to outspeed Parish Song or Destiny Bond, we're good. It's interesting. It's interesting. We got a little bit of the silly here with Double Edge Magic Garden. It's not my favorite recoil move out of all of them, but we learned so many moves, we have the chance at seeing more. We have to fight a Steelix, which is really bad. I might die to the Steelix. I probably will. So, keep that in mind. The Steelix is going to be really awful for me. It's not free. So we probably lose this Mon to the lab. Depending on what the Steelix does, I might need to Shadow Force to PP stall it a little better. So, we'll see if that is needed. Not sure yet. My son. My son? My son? Alright, Steelix. You better have shit moves so I can get through here. Oh boy, here we go. Not bad either. That doesn't matter. I mean, for skill swap, that kind of does matter, because then Double Edge will make me take damage. That's horrible. It's over. Fuck me. God damn it. He had the move, you dingbat. Why did you have the move? Rare doesn't get out of lab moment. Magic Garden Polyon. Sleep Powder Grudge Fling Rock Throw Smog Pedal Dance. Rock Polish Charge Follow Me th Arm Thrust Acupressure Mimic Aqua Ring. Uh. Well, that's not very good. <laughs> that's kind of bad. Where are this thing's special attacks? We get Earth Power, Icy Wind, Vacuum Wave. That's it, man. What the fart? Where are the moves? Crunch is Bugsy. Ugh. Well, that was- that was just a distraction, guys. That wasn't real. That seed didn't happen. That wasn't real because nothing there mattered. So... That didn't exist. Congratulations, we move on. Yep, nothing there was real. Uh, on to the next one. That was not real. Okay, most likely to bitch at their partner about not cleaning the dishes. I feel like it's Gollum. Tropius is like... Tropius would stare, stare them down until they did the dishes. Duskull would not give a shit. It's Gollum. No, Tropius would stare them down. Alright guys, just in case uh, Fire Blast doesn't hit... And Flamethrower is too weak. We also have Eruption on top of that. So that should be great for uh, cleaning up anything that's weak to fire. So it looks like we have coverage on Tropius. Uh, I think that's the case. So guys, uh, anyone want to go over under on whether Tropius has Flash Fire? Tropius has Flash Fire, right guys? Dude, this is just colossal, isn't it? Isn't isn't, isn't this guy colossal? This golem 
when it was a Geodude, was raised by Coalossals. <laughs> we have Shedinja coverage. Nah, Tropius S, Flash Fire, and, and, tr and Frenzy Plant, yeah. It's gonna be Stab, Frenzy Plant. Quad super effective for a 900 power move, and it's gonna crit for 1800 power. I can't wait. Chatting. Uh, we should pivot before we die to Flash Fire Tropius, right, guys? Yeah. I actually... I mean, I actually should look at the pivots, right? Um, I don't know. I wish this was a good Pokemon and not Golem. So that we could run, uh... Shield Dust and this stat spread on a good Pokemon. I almost died. That was very close. Uh, I had a Lucario get to the lighthouse. Walk on Fire Wisp. What's up, CTC? One voter for Duskull. Interesting. Yeah, well, that's fine. It's a good game, it's fun, and very fair. All right, Steelix has Stab Earth Power. Tropius has Stab Energy Ball. What's next in the lab? What's next in the lab, guys? It's just the worst possible moves every time. You called it Riolu? Of course you did. All right, what's next in the lab? Okay, yeah, middle. Huh? Apparently the next thing is my controller stops working. What? How is that even possible? I didn't do anything. Why does it just stop working? What? I don't know. I don't know anymore. I didn't even do anything, dude. I just didn't even do anything. Technology is technologying right now. Right now. <clears throat> it's been a mem it's been a moment since we've been dragon raged. You weren't here yesterday at 4 a.m. Central when I got a Togekiss friend Evo. With Stab Facade, Wing Attack, and Fire Fang, and Curse. And then got Dragon Raged on Bugsy. A woman runner is running Cooking Mama. I, I didn't see the running, the word running. I saw a woman runner is Cooking Mama at pace. And I was like, what? what does that mean? There's so many things that could mean. There weren't mods? Oh shit. Yeah, that sucks. Fuck. Yeah, that actually really sucks. You know what? It's fucking time, dude. I got a quick ball. Caesar shows up. It's Flash Fire Caesar. I turned my webcam on the thing. Stop it. It's Flash Fire Caesar. I've never seen one. 2,800 attempts. I've never seen one. So this right here. This is it. This is it right here. Never seen one. Okay. This is a fun challenge. Dun, 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 I can't wait to run into that with 200 base. Or, I don't even know how much attack that is. It's just ass. Ass shitload of, of attack. 
Yeah, let's just evolve into that. And then it's still illegal. <laughs> you can't evolve into a pure power mon. Or you have to... I don't even know what you do. I think you just cry at that point. Oh! Let's fucking go! You've made a grave error, Fampy! Except I'm just gonna side beam again, so... I guess it's okay. Uh, I don't know, Riolu. I'm just gonna side with no, though. I It did crit twice, yeah. So my anger point should have been activated for plus 12 attack. Honestly got scammed. I got scammed, man. Let me look at this thing again. What the hell does this have? It's just stupid. <laughs> it's just dumb. Idiot gamer. That's what it is. Uh, well, since it's pure power, we can pivot on that route again if there's anything else on the Caesar route. Route 30 there. Yeah, I don't know. I, I just... I, I'll just trend away from it. Levitate Drapion, that's the shit! I had one of those once, too. As a friend, even... Or not a friend, even. An HM friend. <laughs> it, it felt bad. I've had a Levitate Jolteon, too, a long, long time ago, but the stat spread was meh, and it made it to Claire. I think. Or maybe Radio Tower, one of the two. But Buzzy, we're coping. I had a Magic Guard Lucario make it to the Lighthouse. Uh, it was a Giga Tank, so it needed Dragon Dance. If it got Dragon Dance, it could win, but it didn't. <laughs> Then I just rolled a Magic Guard Empoleon in the lab that died to the rival Steelix with Stab Earth Power. Yay! It never learned any moves, though. We checked afterward. It was trash. So that was also a heart wrencher and point of confusion and contention. And wondering, really, what the game has in store underneath all this bullshit. You know, I haven't seen a Caesar in forever, actually, just in general. Caesar hasn't been showing up at all lately. Yeah, I, I, I would assume it's anything goes for the rival fight. I mean, you can heal. You, you can do so much that I would assume it's anything goes. Ampy with enough speed. Let's see what else it has. Oh my. Whoa. Okay. All the stops. All the stops are coming out right now. We're sending it. God damn it, I have to deal with the Caesar. Fuck! Stupid ass Caesar. Has no defense. We're fine. Has no defense, no speed. We're good. We just need coverage. Don't get attached yet. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Are you serious? Poison you, poison you, poison you, please! <laughs> how much, how much, what's the percent? 30! Give me that shit right now. Give me that. Yes. Come on, poison me, you dumb... Oh, <laughs> I can't risk whatever else this has. I need to be at full health. Screech? No way. It's definitely over. It's 
it's over though. I can't. Once it screeches, it's just gone. There's no fucking way I can get through. You could twist her for the flinch, I guess. This is gonna be an L. Yep, I don't see a way around this. I think it's over. Damn. Comet Punch? Just don't you screech, AI. Come on. Oh god, it has freaking... Dude, it has freaking pressure. I just realized that. Oh my god, it's so over. It has no special attack or special defense at all. How am I doing that much damage to it? Okay, uh... Alright, so where we're at now, quad reduced. Out of gunk shots. Rock throw does 8, I think. So Comet Punch is going to kill me, more than likely. So I'm going to go ahead and pot here. Shit, okay. Please. Good lord. I don't care that I'm poisoned right now. Just get me out of here. Dude, why did Twister do so much? That's so stupid. It's 20 power with 6 special attack. How is it doing more than what Slash did? That's so dumb. Why was it doing more? How is that even possible? Even if it has 0 special defense, how is that even possible? How is that even a thing? Math. What the frick? <laughs> yeah, poison does over overall damage. Oh my god, there's Giga Chads everywhere. I need to get out of here. I'm scared. I'm scared. Max Elixir, that's great. I know. I probably should have done Twister earlier. Loveberry, that's kind of useful. Uh, I played that a, a little bad, so I, I mean, I wasted like one more potion than I otherwise would have, I suppose. I can recycle the Lumberry too. Alright, new move. Night Slash, fuck yes, dude. Okay. That shed coverage. Man, we're getting there. We're getting there. Shed coverage. Okay, so, I don't need Twister, do I? Like, yeah, we just saw the draw, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, it's fine. Yeah. And Recycle, I'm, I'm thinking about how Recycle is gonna work. Like, HP Healing Berry on top of Poison Heal kinda makes sense. What else can I recycle that works? White Herb? I guess we could recycle White Herb? Or maybe if we get... Maybe if we get... With this, does Focus Punch work with a Power Herb? Does anyone know that? If I can recycle a Power Herb, I could use a two-turn move, maybe. Super effective Berry, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shuka Berry for sure, because we only have one weakness. That's a huge point. Yeah, good point, good point. Definitely Shuka Berry. I think that's the best one, actually. Yeah, good point. Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. Focus punch, not... What is power punch? Okay, okay. I don't know what power punch is. If it's meant to be the same thing. Yeah, Lepaberry. Yeah. To a lesser extent, I would say. I think the Shuka Berry is maybe the number one. Maybe the number one. I mean, we have to be past Chuck when that's the case. If we're past Chuck, then we can Shuka Berry through and through. Goddamn, what a thick, thick thing. Wow. Okay, we're running into pieces of shit already. Get the hell out of here. 
Bro, really? This guy tanks me into hypnosis hits and mud bump. Act drop. Thank you for Brian the dog. <laughs> oh my god, I... I don't know what to do. I I always get so nervous with these runs, dude. I get so nervous. I <laughs> I don't know what to do. <laughs> My brain is running away from me. This is so good. This is so good. It's like my I don't know if the I think the Jolteon was not as good as this. I think this is probably my best poison heal mod. It showed up as nonsense. Yeah, mine too. My wit, my the width of my chat is wrong in my <laughs> in my dashboard. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just rolled this. Yes, the escape rope. Okay, that's what we could do. We haven't seen one of those in ages. HP heal. <laughs> escape rope room. I can't type. Yes. L. All right, all right, all right. We'll do the escape rope room. We'll do two minutes while I collect myself here. Will there be an HP heal in the escape rope room? There are four items in there. One of them heal my HP. An illegal man. What's up, Milksy? Any good runs today was a Magic Garden Lucario, Magic Garden Polion that died in the lab. And now this. This is definitely my best one. I think. Oh, Shuka Berry. Come on. Okay. Air candy. That's nice. These aren't useless things. <laughs> what are you guys thinking the Pred? 220k in this already. The Golem was Shield Dust, which is also an S tier ability. But not as good as Magic Guard. Ugh, I'm so freaking. I'm so worried about this. Because <laughs> I know the potential of this Pokemon. I know it. I know the potential. It's freaking disgusting. Will one of these four items be illegal HP heal? About 30 seconds left on the Pred. Emery in chat. What's up, Pyromancer? Thank you guys for talking about the Shuka Berry, too. That one was good. Very, very big. Welcome, Amrish. We got back to them. Don't worry. I was doing the level 3 first. Lower level. Thank you for the good luck, Groat. Good to see you all. You're having a wonderful start to your weekends, by the way. Yeah. I see... I see its weak spots. Because we need poison ongoing to heal uh, whilst using recycle for the Shuka Berry. Otherwise, it's a little less strong, even though we're really thick. Really thick. Thank you for the bit, Mr. Raven. Okay, 66% doubt. Here we go. 400k in the pot. Wrong route, dude. That's the wrong route. That's nice, but not an HP heal. Leopardberry Recycle actually is really big, yeah, because I don't want to go to the, the, the centers. Wrong root, wrong berry. L. Yeah, I don't really... I mean, Jirachi's probably not even... I mean, it's not in the wild. Like, we can't even find Jirachi unless it's on a trainer. So, that's kind of out. We'll have a good chance at a red shard to get a Lepa Berry. Uh, with the Rock Smash post Falconer. So, we can get there. I am tanky enough now. I don't want to poison myself for Sprout Tower, despite really wanting to do that. Can I recycle this? <laughs> I don't think so, right? 
mean, it's berry juice. Can you recycle that? Yeah, right now I don't really want to scout. I can, but I don't really want to. You can, yes. That's actually a really important question. I need to know. I need to know if I can recycle berry juice. Does it act like a berry despite being in the, the heal tab of the backpack? Held items that have been used up. Okay, so I mean, yeah, it makes sense that a power herb would work the same way. Okay. Okay. And that can't be plucked. Pluck and bug bite don't work on that. So we could just proactively carry that. I'll do so after the level fives, I think. God. So much strategy. This is why I love Poison Heal. Thinking about how to legitimately beat this. It's tossing some scary mons at me. Signal Beam. Damn. Yeah, Lumberry Recycle. Anger the Sip Caravian, I don't have a beverage anymore. I could do it on a wild, that would probably be a little better. Not too worried about it though. What? <laughs> I know. I know that I can use that. The only worry is outspeed pluck, and then I kill it, and then the berry is gone. So, like, that's not a problem later on when we probably have more resources, but right now I have finite. Finite heals. It's a 750 power move. Assisted. This just doesn't make any fucking sense. I should have bullet punched there. Wow, it actually mattered too. If I get dragon ranged because that mattered, I'm gonna poop my pants, man. That's the dumbest thing ever. Because it did two damage to me. I will actually shit myself. <laughs> that would be Kaizo for you, though. Uh, I'm ready for that. Don't worry, it's definitely a possibility. I'm thinking about the optional trainer last, but also I'm gonna get the level here, so I'm not too worried about that, especially with berry juice. <laughs> okay, could have done it there. You had the opportunity to game, and you threw. You could have dragon raged me, but you didn't. So now it's time to win. I see it. I see the... I see it. Slow start, Carlyon. I can't believe that shit. My head hurts, man. Thank you for the raid, Sean. Hopefully the grind's gone well today. I 
I don't know if that mattered. It probably did. Okay. Oh my god. Fuck, oh, man. Might be over. Do it. Okay, we can recycle the berry juice. want to be confused, but this doesn't seem to be able to do anything to me, so I'm going to get the juice back again here. So fucking stupid. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Jeez, stupid ass sandstorm, dude. Ah, uh, all swipe. <laughs> PP Max recycle. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. A little bit of a jank battle. Okay, classic. New move. T flare. All right. Okay. Faulkner Pred. Very stressful. God, I'm so fucking stressed about this. <laughs> God damn it. Very good. Happy with the tower. More th more so, I'm just happy that nothing had anything bad on that fight. That, as far as I know. I don't know. I one-shot the Moltres. That could have had something. So, as far as I know, we did okay on that, on that fight. Just because nothing was super scary there. Yep, one Pokemon permadeath, randomized challenge, plus 50% levels on everything. Okay. I know, right, Lots? 95% <laughs> on Believe. We could try to scout for poison. Nothing's really going to kill me. I outspeed everything that probably will show up. The only annoying thing is getting stuck in a battle and having to, uh, having to catch it. So we can get extra balls. We're gonna need these anyways. I worried about outspeed? Yes, a little bit. I do need enough for repels. 
We're gonna need these anyways. I'll have enough repels. Yeah, that's the great thing, too, is we have a way to stall for poison because we have recycle. And that's unusual. Like, last time we had poison heal, we couldn't really stall that well. The Luxray could do it, but the last time we had it, we couldn't do it because we didn't have a move that wouldn't kill the wild Pokemon. So now we can. So, I mean, I'll look a little bit. It's a poison type. Lizzie. That mon sucks. I know, mono-electric types seem to be my poison heal. The Houndoom. I've had it on a Houndoom. I've had it on the Lapras too, right? Was it a Lapras that had it? I think so. It's annoying. Switcheroo. Miracle Cock. Alright, well that doesn't have anything. And poison and steel types in. Yeah, the escape rope was done long ago. It was L. No HP heals in there. I'm hoping to get it down here. This would be the least steps to Faulkner's gym. So down here is the best case. What do you have? Of course. I, was fig I figured I was going to see that, and that means that Ditto has Parish Song for the entire run, which is great news. Yep, that's going to have that for the entire run. It learns no moves. Thankfully, it's a low BST Mon. I just have to one-shot it. Well, now we're... Now we're a little worried. It's in headbutt. Grab hammer. Parish cock. Power herb does not work with focus punch. I figured it might not because it's a little bit weird of a move. Mean look. <laughs> shut the hell up. Okay, I'm not going back to that ditto. Thank you for saying that, actually. Don't shut up. But you know what I mean, like, shut up, because that's... That's fucked. Energy <laughs> bungles, beyond. Next seven. It's not looking likely down here. Well, Elekid has one more move, and... Quillfish has two more, but Quillfish is hitting me hard. What's up, Limeade? Thank you, Pezzo. Uh, fucking ditto, dude. It was good scouting, yeah. We learned a lot. I don't know if I want to carry poison all the way over here. Solar dicks. Alright, nothing on Zubat. Scattered that fully. Parish Song. Your cock. Make a kick. Alright, so we know Polytoad's moveset for a little bit now. No poison still. Yeah, and I'm gonna have to- I'm, I'm gonna lose, like, 30 health walking from that route over to Faulkner's Gym. So, it's like, it's kind of worth it. But at the same time, it could be a little bit damaging. So, I'm not- I'm not sure. I'm not sure about this. I've done it from the route below before, 32, but I don't know about this one. Mono Trainer, if I don't one-shot the Pokemon, then yeah, maybe. Oh, shit. Alright, well, we found it. I, well, I mean, that's, a, that's free. That's free poison setup. We have it now for the rest of the game. 
So we found it. So it's on Smoochum. That will be free for the rest of the game. If we make it to Chuck and get Fly, that'll that'll be do that'll be it. That'll be it. <laughs> do I do it for Faulkner though? I don't freaking know. I mean, we can test it and see how fine I am with it. Let's see if this has it too. Take down. Holy shit, this thing has a rock head. <laughs> I'm not interested. Alright, so Smoochum has it. You do it for Faulkner. That's... It, it's probably a good 20 HP, 25 maybe. I won't have any in the gym. Yeah, not for Faulkner at least, but I'm hoping to not need to rely on that. I don't know. I mean, I'm not gonna need the berry juice as much with poison. That's the thing. Like, we could we could lead berry juice and just have one recycle for it. Yeah, like, I, I if I have a lot... If I have a lot lower HP, we can lead it and just do recycle once, but that's basically all we'll need. So it's a little bit annoying trying to set up on this. Just poison! It's two hits, you fuck! <laughs> Why is it not poisoning? <laughs> God damn it, dude. Twin needle poisons so often. How is it not doing it? <laughs> what the hell? I've been hit by it three times. It's like 60% together. It's 30% each hit, I'm pretty sure. This is so stupid. <laughs> it's so dumb. Thank you. Yeah, I think this is worth it. I think so. Twenty per hit. Okay, thirty-six then. Is it twenty? I thought it was thirty percent. We save HP by talking to people. I don't think that resets the counter, no. Okay. Alright, I think we're good to go. Three recycles. That's decent. We're not gonna run into another Kingdra. And I'll do I'll do the first trainer first here. Because I'm probably not gonna one-shot them on, and if I do, then it's whatever. Works. Plus I don't wanna walk around. Looks like I will one-shot them on, after all. Omega lol. Quite the turn. <laughs> Rip. Okay, that sucks. It's not too bad. Alright, alright, right. We're good. We'll 
get the level here, so we'll be 21 when the ace comes out. Can't one-hit KO us. Really scared about the ace. It's another freaking Arceus. I swear to god, man. It's coming out last. Traced poison heal. <laughs> All Rotoms are faster, at the same level. Huge defense and no HP. Wonderful. Not what I wanted to see, but we'll be okay. Good. Hmm. Good. Uh, the poison was good on uh, Faulkner. I'm glad that we did that because of the chip damage from Hale. It was not my favorite thing to come across. Wake Up Slap would be huge if we could get that. Ah. Alright. That kind of sucks, but it's not the end. Not the end. We're fine. Septembo slice. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm enjoying it a lot. All right, and we don't. We don't need pokeballs. Not at all. We don't need pokeballs at all because we. We know exactly what has poison. <clears throat> and we have recycle, so we don't need to throw balls at it for now. I like having a little bit of a repository, but we'll be fine. I'm just gonna keep the juice on. It can't get plucked. It could get switcherooed, I guess, or tricked. But, like, who does that? <laughs> tricked or switcherooed, I guess. <laughs> that's not going to... That's not gonna happen, though. I just don't have a stupid... Alright, we got our Lepaberry. Speaking of the Red Shard. So, Re Lepaberry is in play now. In play. And that's all we needed. We only got one, and it's in play. Very cool. So, Lepaberry Recycle Poison Heal is now active. That is now an active uh, strategy that we have. Very, very cool. Very cool. We do not have the Shuka Berry yet. That's the other one we need for the funny fun. The funny fun. Smooch them anywhere else. I don't really... I mean, I guess, like, just in case they're near a... Another gym, but no, they're just there. Okay. I I don't really. I mean, the the chances of finding another thing for Azalea is not the highest. I was thinking that. Um, I I guess I'll probably scout. <laughs> I I guess I'll probably scout for each gym. I might as well because I have recycle for now. Plan on keeping recycle as best I can. I don't know what the future holds. That thing is gigafast, so it's not going to have anything else. Good grief. Nature's gift. <laughs> yeah, let me get nature gift. I would love to get that. Genuinely. Acne is super tanky. Can we take the... The poison with us with that combo heal on wild mons with recycle uh the problem with that is that it would just like i'm i'm 
kind of delegated to being around half HP. I'd rather be full. I would kind of, like, in order for the heal to proc, like, I would already have to be below half, and I'd like to be a little higher than that. But I see what you're saying. We could carry poison through everywhere doing that. Almost everywhere. That'd be a little tough, but yeah. <laughs> Well, I don't know how, um... I don't know how Recycle works with the Lepa Berry. That's the thing. Like, I don't know if you can recycle... Recycle's PP with the Lepa Berry. I don't think that's possible. Can we scout a teleporting mon? That feels illegal to me. You can? Oh yeah, that makes sense. Okay, never mind. I see how it works. I got it. I got it. It's bandage in competitive Pokemon. Yeah, I see how it works. I'm I'm on. I'm up to speed. It's fast. Lots of fast mons in this seed. Finally, it's been a while since I've seen a bunch of fast Pokemon. Do I really do that, though? Do I really do that? Do I really go to Route 31 right now, get poisoned, and carry it all the fucking way down here with wild mons and lepa berries? That sounds so ass. <laughs> that sounds a little bit too ass to me. Jeez. <laughs> Uh, I'm- and I am a little bit concerned about this trainer, too. The level 23 could ruin me. I don't usually skip him, but it's kind of freaking me out a little bit. It's kind of freaking me out a little bit. I don't know- I never skip this guy, but it's kind of bad. The fishing things are level 15 to look for poison with. I don't know if I want to do that for now. It's a little too close on level. Teleport would be on an HM friend is illegal. <laughs> uh, so, a little concerning. Yeah, I can afford to skip this. If it's like a point of contention, like I might as well skip it. It's half a level. I'll be okay. Interesting come work. I hope that goes, uh, I hope that goes well for you. Thanks for the resub. <laughs> we'll see on the, the left lab pick. This one's gonna take a while, I think, so we'll see, uh, what it's like when we get there. Yep. No, I'll come back after Goldenrod for sure. There's the white herb. So I, I can, I can recycle that. That would help me with Intimidate once we know what has Intimidate. Because Intimidate is still going to be a problem with this. Whitney's TM is Pluck. Oh shit. Alright, can we learn Pluck from Whitney? No. Oh. There goes Wake Up Slap and Pluck TMs. That sucks. Hmm. Okay. That's not good. That is not good. Yeah, both of those were acceptable moves, which is why it kind of sucks. Alright, new move. Steel Wing. Is that better than Bullet Punch? I think so. I think so. Despite the accuracy. It's just better coverage on rock and ice for now. I think it's okay. I just... I don't need priority here. I don't want to have priority with a shitty move. 
it were Mach Punch, I would consider it, but... I don't know. It, it feels really bad. A, hey, by the way. It feels really bad to use a high crit rate... To not use a high crit rate move. That's almost the same power as the super effective damage. You know what I mean? Like, we could just have a chance at the crit, too. And just do way more. Okay, another red shard. Ugh. How, how good is this run compared to average? This is like an 11 out of 10. And it's in the early game, but the, the thing is we recognize the potential of it. So it's very stressful as a result. Two Lepos now, yeah. That's not correct. We don't have burn heal. <laughs> okay, another person. Very nice. Yeah, Kraz is run dying to worry seed into Heatran like that. Yeah, that's absolutely tragic. Oh, and then jump kick, right? Yeah, I forgot that. And you can see it in his face, too. I watched it back. You can, you can see it in his face that he's just like, this is kind of bad. And then he misses. God, it sucks so fucking bad. Yep, I, I know that feeling, though. <laughs> I know that feeling. Flygon, Shellgon, Cherim. Stab space we're in, that's not great. Fisher, that's not great. Owl, that's not great. You have poison. Okay, that grass is pretty much dead. That grass is pretty much dead. Unless Shellgon has a poison move, it's just in Shellgon. I don't really want to bother with the Cherim. It only has one more move. So that grass, not sure about it. Having anything? Dude, that thing's so fast. Fast Kaka. Literally the opposite of what it usually is. Uh, which means I can't be poisoned for the rival fight. Unless I carry it through Slowpoke well, does the dude heal me? No, right? He doesn't heal me. I need it. I need it before the well, don't I? I do. Yeah, I... I, I need it before the well. This, this doesn't activate it, right? I haven't beat the well yet, so he's not here. Is he? Did I fuck up? Does anybody know that? Like, he he's not here because of the well, right? I have to beat the well first before the rival. I don't know, man. These are things that I just don't remember. You have to? <laughs> I don't trust one input. I don't trust one input. We need more than that. You're soft locked. <laughs> you have to lose your run. You will lose your run if you do this. Smile. Save and reset? I don't want to do that. That's shit. That's not fair. It says something about you beating Team Rocket. It make yeah, I think so too. <laughs> Pokemon Silver. All right, he shouldn't be here.
Find a let's play and find out, yeah. Kaizo moment. Oh, buddy. Kaizo moment for sure. Surely you have a poison move. Great. Just put the left on while scouting for poison. I don't want to accidentally mess it up. I'm going to mess it up. There's so many things to think about. <laughs> I'll forget to recycle it. Yeah, I'll 10 head it, really. You're right. I'll be out here 10 heading it. No. You're so annoying. Oh. Sky uppercut. Weezing is dead. I mean, I could just scout because I'm asleep. Ah. <laughs> I hate this. Just give me poison. Poison me. I don't know if it still has extreme speed. It won't use its last move, so it's probably nothing important. Armando. Coveted. Does Covet steal the does Covet steal the item too? I've literally never had that happen to me. That's never happened to me ever in Kaiser. <laughs> Alright. There are more than just two spawns in, but the rest of these are rare. So they're gonna be really annoying. Stab Judgment Snorlax. Dark Void Snorlax. Sucker Punch. Uh, blah. The switcheroo? I still have my juice on, too. Gosh, I'm, ta I'm taking a risk. I'm taking a risk, man. I still had the juice. Yeah, everything has sleep and not poison. Fuck. I could go back to the shell gun, look at the shell gun one more time, just see if it will just not use swagger, please. Ugh! Stop it, you dingy! I'm running out of options, though. Twister. And bug bite. Okay. It does not have poison. I don't think anything has poison. I've seen anything with headbutt. No. We have not. I don't know if I'm willing to go to that length. That's that's interesting. That would be a little much, maybe. <laughs> headbutt. On the HM friend to scout trees for poison before we get to fly. I don't know. I don't know if I should do that. <laughs> I don't know if I should do that. That's, you know, I use. So here's my thing. Here's my take on that, right? I use the HM friend with headbutt at the very start before Sprout Tower to look at pivots. That's why I re enter Dark Cave to look at pivots. If it's not to look at pivoting, I feel like. It's not fair. Because you're not benefiting your uh, the Pokemon that you're running by getting a pivot, but you are benefiting the Pokemon you're running by getting poison for poison heal from an HM friend. Does that make sense? So no, I, I don't think I'm okay with that. Or I don't think I would do that, rather. I mean, I have recycle. I could do this. I don't want to be confused. I'll have a repel on for first. I'm not going to scout for poison. Maybe until before the last trainer, depending on where we're at. Maybe. 
I don't think I want to... I don't... I'm a little hesitant about scouting in here. But if Ampy learns Headbutt... Headbutt arguably better than Slash, because we have Night Slash for the high crit rate. Then yes, we would take it. <laughs> Let's go, CTC. Rats on the shine. Right, this thing's a giga tank, yeah. Wow, oh, gosh. So now the question is, should I try to scout? <laughs> I don't think so, in case I get burnt uh, or paralyzed. I don't think I should do that. I mean, we have heal powders, and they're probably not going to be used too much. Or I have one, sorry. I have that and a lumberry. I could recycle the lumberry, but then if I get poisoned, it's also bad. And then I just take the lumberry off. Oh, I don't know. Yes, I'll just take damage. I'll just take damage. What do you mean? And then, see, here's the thing, is like, once we get poisoned, we can just Lepaberry recycle to restore HP on a wild. That's possible. Like, that, that could work, right? That works, right? Pretty sure it does. <laughs> Jesus Christ. There's not going to be poison. Yeah, it's Bugsy with no poison right now. And also the rival fight with no poison. I'm not sure. Like, the way I see it is I can recycle a Lumberry for a while until I find the Poison Mon to avoid being burnt. And then I can start recycling a Berry Juice if needed. And then once we get poison, I can put on the Lepa Berry and stall on a Wild Mon with Recycle Lepa Berry. Except, I have to use another move. No, no I don't. We're good, we're good. I keep forgetting how Lepaberry works with the stupid thing. <clears throat> so like, this this is doable, and, 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 unless there's no poison, this is bad. If there's no poison, this is bad. That's the only thing. And there might not be. There, there might not be any poison, so that would, would that would be what makes it bad if there's no poison. That would be the concern. So, yeah, that's the problem. And there probably won't be. <laughs> there probably won't be. How often do I heal when scouting a patch of grass? That's because I, I, I was just doing that for recycle that uh, PP for the most part. That was what I was doing. Well... Let's just get through the early game, I suppose. And if we can't make it through the early game, is it really meant to be? Question here is Cherry or Person? I think I want to go Person. No, Headbutt hasn't shown up yet. Okay. Well, I need luck. I need luck to get through this part. If we can make it out of this part, we have a really good shot. Because then it's just Morty that's scary, really. So that's it. I just need luck here, guys. Just need some luck. Need to crit this.
Can you guys stop talk? Can you guys start talking about like full restores or something? That would be great. Start talking about full restores. Then maybe those will show up. It's all trash. I shouldn't have said that though. What are you actually going to have? Yeah. That's what I thought. This could evolve into something pretty bad. Alright. Rival down. One scary fight. The, the other is Bugsy. Do I want four restores or do I want max potions? <laughs> yeah, shit. Right, max potions, max potions. Ah, uh, max potions, guys, not four stores. <laughs> now I misspoke. Now I'm gonna get four stores. They're gonna be so troll. Oh, it's gonna be so stupid when we get a four store. All right, will I beat Bugsy? There you go, guys. Fun pred for you. Will I beat Bugsy? Oh my god, if I could just get some random poison proc, that would be great, man. I'm pretty sure Ilex Forest has more than three spawns on the ground. Like, it does. It does. We saw three of- I think it has four. But one of them is probably really rare. And I don't think it shows up on the tracker. Yay! Alright, that's- that's good. That's pretty good. Hyper Potion, man. We take those. Alright, a little bit more insurance that I would like to hold on to, but it's insurance for now. Because we're really tanky, we should be able to hold it. Oh my god. I need a fan on me, dude. Freaking sweating over here. This is stupid. Alright, I guess we go in with this. Okay. Come on, Bugsy, let me out of the early game. We could get so far! We could get so far, come on, you have to. Oh my god! Just do it. <laughs> Fine. If I make it out of this, we have humongous potential. Especially out of Whitney, when I can get past Goldenrod. Because then I can get poison, we can- we- we can tail a- uh, a Recycle Lepa through wild Pokemon on our way up to Morty and all around the map. And I will fucking do that. I will do that. You just watch me. So we have to get out of Whitney for that. Even before Fly, we're semi-safe, it's just really annoying. Oh my god. 28. I'm toast. If it got a move, I'm so toast. Oh my god. Please don't. Ugh. I think it lives by merit of HP alone, man. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. What? How is that even possible? I'm so thick. I'm so thick. I mean, honestly, do I recycle here or do I get rid of it? Because it should miss. I kind of want to keep that person buried. Yeah, I don't want it to hit again. It's 50%, man. I don't want it to hit again, though. That's 10 damage I don't need to take. Yeah, definitely second ability. Oh, God. Every freaking decision to make here is so important.
Bro. Don't start. Come on. Don't waste my PP like this. Right, we'll recycle a Lepaberry on your ass too. I got I got ways to get around this man. Try me, bitch. <laughs> Caesars have pure power. Oh my god. Can you quit it? Cut it out, man. Sure. Let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the setup, idiot. Follow me to death. That's where we're going. Death. Thanks for the setup. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> what? Swagger person very recycle. What a fucking Giga Chad play. Oh my god. I'm having so much fun with this damn run. I swear. Recycle, poison heal, like everything. The two things that basically alter your strategy the most are in the same run here. That's so wild to me. It's so freaking funny. Earth power? Come on! What? Why? Why? Why that move, though? Signal beam earth power is what this thing's learned. That's so ma messed up, man. Very flashy. Natural gift! Ow! Jesus. What should that do? Natty gift, dude. Alright, right, right. So, we're going into Bugsy. Do I hold the juice in Recycle? I feel like that's not a good play. Because it's less than a fifth of my HP. That might not be good. So, should we... I should probably Lum Recycle. Yeah, let's Lum Recycle. That makes more sense, right? We can use our regular pots for now. I think Lum Recycle is best here. Please, let me through. Seed Flare as well, yes. But Poison? Yeah, I know. But Burn. <laughs> it's gonna be useless after Fly, exactly. In fact, it's gonna be useless after Whitney. of all the different possibilities here. If I get swaggered again, that's going to be the worst case. Especially if it's outspeed swagger. That would be the worst case. I'm... I'm... I'm we, we do have the hyper potion. I do need to remember that. We have the hyper pot. I'm okay because of that. Because I'm thinking about the berry juice or lum right now. That's the two I'm between. <clears throat> oh, jeez. Come on. It is going to use Mist here, I think. Water. Oh god. Okay, Lanoon. Pressure, that's kind of bad. Sh 
Shut up, guys. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to fucking hear it. Don't want anybody say anything. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> don't anybody say a word. Uh. Damn it, crit is gonna kill me. And I don't know if I hit this or not. I'm stuck in my only options, Hyper Potion. Fuck. Damn it, crit will kill. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me, and it's a roll. This is so stupid. I do not want to hyper if I can help it. It's so bad to hyper. I know we can't lose this mon. And I'm probably gonna have to do it anyways, because there's still three mons after this. Yeah, shit. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Is this... I know. But the problem is, there's, this mon has... You don't understand how good Poison Heal is when you get Fly. You don't understand how good it is. <laughs> I need I need to get past... I don't even need Fly in this case, because we can, we can recycle Leppa. I feel like I need to. Yeah, but normal potion doesn't do anything. I'll just be right back in the same spot. No, it's not easy to find another hyper potion. Not at all. It's not easy at all. <laughs> we'll probably find him, but sometimes I just go completely dry on heals. Because I run the silly berries, so... He might be confused. Yeah, then I risk the crit. That's the whole reason I'm doing this, is crit. There's also the possibility of Aftermath, and Ruffs- well, no rough skin, but uh, Aftermath here is possible. Alright, fuck it. I really want to get there, man. I'll do anything. I am usually extremely aggressive on healing. On not healing, I mean. I'm extremely aggressive. This is the one case where I'm not. That was an ember. What the actual metric fuck? Oh my god. That's good. We were s we were boned by that, by the way. <laughs> we would have been boned by that if I hadn't healed, so the hyper potion was required for sure. It's this trash, man. Can I kill it? That's a crit. Uh, it's fine if that's what it's gonna prioritize. Bugsy only has one heal, so. Yeah, we'll just go. Hyper was required, so I don't feel bad about it. I don't feel bad. The moves are struggling. Oh my god. That hyper was incredible. When did we pick that up? Was that... That was in Union Cave, right? Or is that an Ilex Forest? That was Ilex? Dude, we were dead without it. That was so clutch.
Some people, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Some some people do the forest after Bugsy. <laughs> Unreal how tight of a boundary this is just sitting on. How much PP I used in that gym as well. Good night, man. This thing is absolutely ridiculous run right now. <laughs> this is just a stupid run right now. I can't believe it. I I'm pretty sure we were dead without that hyper. I mean, maybe if the Ember didn't crit, but, like... Tough. God, I'm so nervous about this. I can barely think. I've been streaming for four and a half hours? It's 3.30 in the morning? What the shit? <laughs> that does... I lost complete track of time and everything doing this run, dude. I've lost... Uh, I've lost uh, my sense of awareness doing this. That's how... That's how into this I am. <laughs> this is so weird. Thank you for having the bits, Queen. I appreciate it. Energy root, let's go. <laughs> okay. Who, who is that? We'll get another one. Who is that? Ver Verdi. Keep talking, my friend. Two ice heels. We're iced. Get iced, dummy. All right. We've got. We found another hyper potion. Good. Ilex 4 is coming through right now. Hilarious. Getting woken up by a rat? <laughs> what? <laughs> My chat's going off the rails right now. I'm sorry that happened to you. Okay, heart scale. Oh my gosh. I can barely think. So we have a lot more things to look at here before Whitney, in terms of being poisoned. If we get poisoned early, there is a chance that I could consider going to the gym early. I would like to be 35 before that happens. 35 or more. Um, but there, that is a chance we could do that. This is such trash XP right now. Good grief, this is so far behind. Very far behind. Oh, it's scratching on your window. I gotcha. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> I understand your dilemma now. Um, we can do the we can do the trainer on the bridge after. Oops. We can do that after Whitney. That is when we can go back. So we're stuck in the goldenrod. We're stuck in the goldenrod line of things now until we are done with that gym. Oh my god, this XP, dude. What is this? Ermia's block, just in case I run into one. And Jask has no D. Oh, this XP is garbage. I'm not even 33 out of this route. Oh my gosh, how is that even real, man? That's so bad. Alright, more item checks, a lot more trainers. Just very far behind. So many baby mons there. We have one rare candy, so, I mean... It won't be that far behind for the entire run. I already had an escape rope. That's our second one. I've not seen it for like a hundred runs, and now we get the escape ropes, finally. What mon had poison? Uh, it was Lanoon. Lanoon had poison fang. Toxic orb, if only. <laughs> uh, no. Toxic will just be regular poison heal. Ovaltine. I'm pretty sure, at least. I think I've done that before. Alright, bikes for chat. Yeah, I know, it's taunting me with the Toxic Orb. Enjoy your bikes. 
up, Nocturna? Ampy run, but then some. Ampy run and then some. Uh, yeah, or so. <laughs> Actually, it's a me favorite. I don't think chat really... Some of chat knows about Poison Heal, but, um... I've yet to show them the true power of it, I think. Yeah, we'll look at Lanoon real quick. Cherry Grove and Mount Mortar. It's either surf or fishing. Or in the trees. Probably not gonna find it. Uh, oh. What? That took five slashes. What the dick and balls. That took five slashes, dude. It's just a little bit more than I expected. Just a couple. Very good, Antonius, yeah. Poison Heal is my favorite ability. Most fun ability, my favorite ability in the game for Kaizo. Alright, great XP there. Thank you, trainer. That was wonderful. Alright, new move. Double hits? No. It's getting tough to work with the moves that we have. Uh, I was really hoping for more moves, but Wake Up Slap and Pluck from the gyms have both been unlearnable. And I... Honestly, would have taught both of them. Wake up slap over steel wing, pluck over slash, probably. But nope. Leverage will o wisp. Wait, what do you mean? Magic bounce. <laughs> If something is extremely unfairly broken, then I don't know about that. But like Poison Heal, you can still get one shot by everything, you still have everything to go right. Friendship thing? Yeah. Yep, that is, that's a thing, too. Get Dugong lives. Dugong lives at 15, it's worth a note. Oh, is it Gen 5? Oh, Magic Bounce is in Gen 5. Okay, what is that? I actually haven't heard anybody talk about that in relation to Kaizo. I don't remember myself. It's been forever since I've seen every single thing, and I haven't studied up Gen 5 yet. Because I'm still stuck in this entirely, so... <laughs> it's a crit, it probably mattered. All non-damaging moves are reflected back. Oh, so it's just inherent... It's just inherent magic coat. And <laughs> Drought Sword would be nice silly, man. Inherent Magic Coat. Wow. Yeah, that might be worse than Inherent Transform. Honestly, they're both really freaking bad. <laughs> they're both really bad for me. Oh, man. I don't know if I've seen... I don't know if I've seen Magic Bounce be a problem before, because usually... Usually, you're not using the moves that would uh, do that in, to the opponent in Kaizo. You're using damaging moves and your own setup. So I'd see that. I'd say that's very rare.
Okay, that sucks. Give me fire punch, please. <laughs> oh, an antidote. As a rules, there you go in that command. I haven't been poisoned yet for the early Whitney gym. I'm still, like, keeping an eye out for that. How much damage did that Vigorot just do? That's ridiculous. Still keeping an eye on that in case I... <laughs> toxic, wow, alright. I'm paying attention, game. Yeah, you can show me toxic. We're all laughing. Toxic orb, toxic, yeah, we're all laughing right here, Ian. Fighting looks better for my coverage? Okay, I'll just go ahead and teach un unlearnable wake up slap. I'll slap the Ampharos until it learns wake up slap. Wake up! Learn the move, dummy! Yep, that was from Faulkner. Fal uh, Whitney, that we're about to fight, has unlearnable pluck, which we found in Union Cape. Also tragic. Flame body. Okay, this is this is pretty bad actually. Thank God for that crit. If that third mom was Reggie Gigas, um, I would have had to heal my burn off, and then <laughs> I don't think we would have lost. But that was, uh, you know, not bad, not not good, not good, not good at all. Technician is always super cool. I like, I really like technic technician and tinted lens in this in this challenge as well. They allow so many more moves to be viable. We can quit any time, man. You don't have to keep being toxic. How is this real? Toxic TM, toxic plate, toxic orb. This is stupid. <laughs> Every toxic item. What are we missing? This game is super troll. Super fucking troll. Alright guys, get ready to vibe. Antidote, yeah. Yes, I did. I do have the more poison barn. Big shrooms. I would take sharpen over recycle once I'm once I have fly. Once I have fly, I would do it. Maybe. Be a bit tough, but I think so. That slow bro had a lot of health. 
But yeah, I mean, set up on a, a spread like this already is just inherently beautiful. And we'll always, we'll pretty much always be poisoned once we have fly, so... Like, yeah, yeah, I would... Only problem is it might, it might reduce my ability to walk around just a little bit due to Recycled Lepa helping a lot. So, I'm not 100% wow drought for any... Yeah. Smells like Raimi! Has low HP. Steel types suck. Yep, I do have the heart scale as well. Alright, it doesn't look like I... Doesn't look like I'm gonna get poisoned off of any trainers, okay? So, no poison off trainers. Now we enter the scouting phase. Pre-Whitney. Pre-Whitney, we are going to enter the scouting phase for possible poison. What? No. No. No way. I... <laughs> what? What the hell, dude? On my poison heal run? The fuck? <laughs> we got poke runs. Oh my god, man. <laughs> Shit. How many moments do I have to use this month? It's a sign. We'll make it a moment. Alright, last moment of the month. On the eighth day of the month. There's just too much shit happening this month. So many moments, man. My reaction to that was too good. That's gotta be, gotta be fucking kidding me. Yeah, that happened on... Was it the tank growth or was it a tank growth? I don't remember which, but it did, yeah. I should have gotten the old rod at this point. That was kind of a throw. Jesus, man. Wicked. Stab Blizzard. Ball. Use something else. Who had the Poke Rust? I'm. I mean, it would be one of the trainers in between the last time I healed and that time I healed. So, one of the trainers in National Park probably had it. How? <laughs> Don't fucking ask me, man. How did I notice the um the nurse Joy says, "Bruh, how'd you get a Pokemon that lucky or something?" It gives you an extra text box, whereas normally you can just walk away like that. I noticed the text box, I closed it immediately, but I was like, wait, what? That's not supposed to be there. The only thing that can be is Pokeros. Because normally, um, Elm would call you. Professor Elm would call you. But we have calls turned off, so now it's just the, the lady tells you. Your mash, okay. That is a no-go. Whatever, I'm just gonna go back. Yep. To get Pokeros is uh, basically, it's almost three times as rare as a shiny. I've gotten Pokeros five times now, and I've seen four shinies. That seems a little bit whack. This route doesn't have data? They only have data for the first few routes? That kind of sucks. I was hoping I could see, like, if we got everything here. I understand why it's not implemented, though. Nobody cares about pivoting up here. Use a different fucking move. What are you doing? God, that's so annoying. Yeah, I do have a- I- I've not- I just haven't seen any lab shinies. I feel like that's definitely a big contributor. Just not seeing lab shinies. 
I wish I had the old rod. That was a mistake not having it by here. Damn. Hydro pump. Supersonic, okay. If I don't know if there are only three Pokemon there, but I that's all I've been able to get. Yeah, damn it. I wish I had the old rod, that would help. I wasn't thinking clearly. Because I thought about it earlier, but I was like, ah, I'm it's fifth level 15s are a little too high for me to just scout right now, but I'd have four more Pokemon to look at here if I did. Jass doesn't have anything. I should probably just put the lep on. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it, it just cuts down on time running back and forth. That's all. I'm just worried I'm going to do something stupid with it. So, not Kaizo. Kaizo hasn't been finished with the shiny, but Survival in Heart Gold Soul Silver has. Survival Heart Gold Soul Silver has been beaten by Ice Twig, who is raiding with a shiny Nidoki. Yes. Wow, that was fucking timing and a half, Twig. How the hell did you get. <laughs> How did you time that? Somebody just asked me if somebody is one with a shiny. <laughs> what a freaking timing, dude. That's wicked. Thank you for the raid. Um, I am doing this. So, yeah. <laughs> this is what I'm doing. <laughs> Welcome to. <laughs> oh. You serious? <laughs> Toxic spikes. <laughs> Fuck, man. Thank <laughs> you, jeez. That's so stupid. Welcome to this. Oh, welcome to this. How was your? Uh, were you, are you still doing platinum? I'm. So here's the thing: is because we have recycle and the lepa berry. Um, as soon as I beat Whitney, I'm good to go because my poison. Uh, my poison guy is on Route 31. Smooch him, easiest move set ever, Twin Needle. It's just, it's perfect. And then all I have to do is recycle Lum, or recycle Lepa, to poison heal, stall on wilds, on the way up to anything that I need to go to. So I just need to beat Whitney, and I'm outside the gym right now, I'm, that's what I'm doing. Just scouting everything before the gym. And I'm not, like, uber worried about it, because I should be able to win against Whitney without it, but, like, it's still kind of sketchy. Uh. Nope, you can't switch. So Toxic Spikes is, uh, kind of a scam. <laughs> but yeah, I've, uh, I've had a lot of fun with this. I did Bugsy without being poisoned. That was kind of scary. It's very scary, actually. I think I'm just gonna go in. Since we have Recycle, I have ways to mitigate bad things. So I think I'm just gonna go in. Because we still have the Energy Root. The only problem is the Lum keeps me from getting poisoned mid-gym, and I kind of want that, but I just really don't want to be burned or paralyzed. It's like, I'm okay with that, I think. It's tough. Yeah, Whitney is, should be free. Rat 34 has a 5% spawn. Is that this one? Oh, okay. Thanks for uh, pulling that up. I wasn't able to find it. <laughs> okay, we can search a little bit for it. It's gonna be a little ass cheeks. If it had Whirlwind and Toxic Spikes, then yes, we could do that. But it didn't have Roar or Whirlwind or anything. No problem, MVP. I don't usually go this late either, but I I lost track. This run has taken so much mental power from me that I lost track of time. Um, the forest doesn't have anything. We already we already went through that for Bugsy. Ah oh, shit! Really? Alright, well, we'll catch and release, sure. 
fuck. God damn taunts, are you kidding me? Oh, that's so troll. Alright, I don't feel like trying that, that's dumb. I don't feel like trying that, so... I'm not going to look at the moves. I don't know what it was. Nice, Ack. Happy to help. Whitney is free anyways, guys. We can do this. Mm, come on, Whitney. Oh, yeah, let's go in the casino to Gamba. I haven't done the Gamba yet. <laughs> I was like, oh, ready to go. We'll go in the casino. Okay, will I beat Whitney? One minute, and we'll listen to some jam to some jammers while we do that. Gamba, open! Five percent believe no poison setup. I tell you, once we got off Whitney, we will always have poison setup for basically everything that matters. At least I'll try to. Kaizo solving all Bulbapedia errors. All right, ninety ten. Let me get one PP back on Recycle, because I'm definitely going to need that. Oh, also, Twig, I didn't tell you, and Chad, and everybody, all, all Kaizo-aligned streamers. Not only do I have this Poison Heal Ampharos, but it has Pokeros. <laughs> yeah, so this is a, a the run. Surely. Goofy. We're goofing around here. So that's for, that's for the Raiders. We also have Pokeros, which is a 1 out of 21,000 something chance. That's cool. This thing has block. Cock. Bro. Yeah, and my HM friend is a pure power Caesar. <laughs> Alright, come on. Flo slow start, float, so let me go. Okay, not too bad. Not too bad. It's form. Ah. Oh god. Jesus, really? Okay. Come on, just hit. That's there. That's a thing. Dude! Okay. <laughs> oh! What is going on? Alright. Okay. Really need some moves, yeah. Ooh. 
please. Eh. Uh, that's really bad. Just don't miss. Come on, Ampy. Nice. Great kills. Okay. Dude. Really? Ugh. Let me through. Don't. Okay. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> oh my god, you're scaring the shit out of me. Fucking metronome. Fuck you, Whitney. <laughs> oh. Oh. And we kept the energy root. Let's go. Oh my god, yes. Big checkpoint, dude. Big checkpoint, guys. It's so... it's big. Anyways, uh, Whitney gives pluck, but it's not learnable. Unfortunately. Oh my god, man. I really didn't want to use the heal. This is so good. Pluck. Unlearnable. Yes. <laughs> ah! That's the most stressed, stressful Whitney fight I've ever had. Poison heal, man. This freaking run's gonna take my heart out. Yes, level 23. I head down there so I don't forget that. Turn in the red shard. Golly, alright. Now we have access and full sustainability to our wild poison, uh, poisoning Pokemon, which is a Smoochum on Route 31 with Twin Needle. We have full access to that, the ability to carry it through the entire map, basically, um, with Recycle Lepaberry Stall on wild Pokemon. We cannot be statused. The only thing we can do is be blocked in, which means we have balls to catch and release. Or Parish Song, I guess. We know Ditto has Parish Song, and will always have Parish Song. So that's one thing. Yep. Alright. So, late night chat. If you'd like a chance at a gift sub, and you've stuck around through this uh, Ampharos run taking forever, you can guess what the Suda Wuda will be randomized into. If you get it right, you get a gift sub, so just point it in the chat. Guess what the pseudo voodoo will be randomized into? Any late night viewers. Get a gift sub. You have about 30 seconds. I'll read them all out, too. When I read them out in the poke rap style, or not really, but like similar to it, it'll get the chat's attention. Send your guesses in. Chance for blue dogs. Oh. Here it is right there. <clears throat> In honor of my first poison heal run that enlightened me on how good this ability actually is, it was a Jolteon that died outside of Victory Road to a random ace trainer with a Steelix that stabbed crit bone clubbed me. I would have been in Kanto with that Jolteon. I don't know if I would have won, but that was it. If that hadn't happened... That was my gonna be my first Kanto run and everything. That thing was busted good. I will choose Jolteon. Jolteon, Jolteon is my pick. <clears throat> Alright, Ho, Quagsire, Noctowl, Umbreon, Pidgey, Centret, Buizel, Torkoal, Magikarp, Poliwhirl, Melodic, Geodude, per Pupitar, Burmy, Beedrill, Ditto, Lapras, Darkrai, Bidoof, Luxio, Apom, Donfin, Golava, Croconaw, Flygon, Fulbix, Vulpix. Ah. 
Forterra, Spiro, Skarmory, Blaziken, Trico, Skiplum, Sceptile, Houndoom, Shellcon, Scyther, Flareon, Sudowoodo, Farfetch, Drowsy, Tropius, Nidoran, Geodude, Slowbro, Sudowoodo, Apom, Mr. Mime, Slugma, Jolteon, Kyogre, Staryu, Steelix, Togekiss. Mine of uh, Jolteon. The Tang. Any Tangers? Any Tangy Gamers? Tangy Gamers. Alright, Red Shard first. I have a bunch of things, small things that I need to remember here. Red Shard. I don't really need the Old Rod. Like, I'm fine just taking my time crossing the map with Lepaberry. I don't need the Old Rod to scout more things. I don't think so. Thank you, Hobo. It's not Aggie. It's not Quillfish. Butterfree. Okay. We probably would have been fine there. But it was worth being careful. wondering how hard I should how hard I should uh, push poison heal like should I push it for these trainers up here cuz I could I could do that <laughs> although these mods in the grass are like mid 20s they'll probably take a good chunk of HP out of me so probably not yet Disneyland China thank you for the four months by the way appreciate the resub What's the reason not to? Because what we'd stall on up here is a little bit higher level, and Poison Heal might not be efficient at restoring my HP. I probably just do like preliminary scouting first to see which thing I want to use like, encounter for Poison Heal. Like, I'd be fine with a Bonsly, so that that would be a good... So when we come up here, we'll use Bonsly. Or Bidoof, yeah, both of those are good, so we have two decent mons to run into. And Sandshrew, okay. All three of... So this is a safe scout for Poison Heal midpoint, checkpointing. So, happy with that. Need to do a bunch of bunch of small stuff in here. Even with that level 23 fight, I'm just so far behind in XP. So far behind. It's like a level behind my average. Yeah, the clouds are on. Take a look. Player's TM is recover. I don't need that. I thought I released the Nitto King. Oh no, I deposited it. Whatever. It does the same thing. I'm not gonna see whatever it has. At least I shouldn't. Yeah, I just deposited it. Because in order to release it, I'm pretty sure the moves pop up and I, I have to know a set a, a set of inputs without looking at the screen, which is kind of annoying. Cherry berry. <clears throat> Alright, well now that we know that, let's uh let's do a test run here. 
Let's do a test run of how our poison heal route is going to work. Pointing the girls. So let, let me show you how this is gonna... Let me show you how this is going to work, okay? Until we get fly. And even thereafter. A up up A up A. <laughs> yes, that. So here, until we get fly, this is how we're going to make things work. What's up, Tinker? Good morning. Coke Ultimate Review would drink again, would not buy a 12-pack. Okay. Sounds expected. Fuck off. You have Endeavor? Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Doof is not safe. You have Sonic Boom? You fuck faces! Come on, you stupid idiots. <laughs> oh. Bruh, are you kidding me? My save checkpoint actually sucks ass. Take a little longer. There you go. I'll probably take the Lepaberry off between each fight. Before each fight, rather. But that is how it works. On, probably not safe. Fuck. <laughs> this thing sucks. That was a crit. Relatively low D. Good to know. Crit, no info. The non Evo is the thing that lived. That makes sense. No more level up moves? We have four more. God. Ooh. Okay, Gly score, big problem until it loses that. Take a peek in here. Something that's not hip out on. This thing just died, so let's check it. Mm. 
It's mildly annoying. You just run if that happens, though. Seems safe. Some thing about Roserade is uh, D-Bond, I suppose. New level up move. Roleplay. Do I want that? No. I don't want to lose my ability. Why would I want that? Idiot game. You mean roleplay? <laughs> the hell out of here. Not roleplaying shit. It's a good attack. And defense. Good attack and defense, I'm Megan. Go straight to Lighthouse? Uh, I don't need to. I don't need to because it's gonna get a little bit messy with the, the Lepa Berry and this thing showing up. Well, we know we one-shot at a 26, at least. It's a little messy with the PP situation. I mean, I could try it, but, like, it's... I don't like the prospect of getting to... I would do Radio Tower, or Burn Tower anyways, first. So, no. This'll be, this'll be one heal, and then I'll go back to the Staravia. Yeah. It just gets... It just gets a little bit messy with uh, multiple moves running out of PP and potentially ending the fight on one of them and essentially losing the Lepa Berry as a result. I have two, but I'd just rather not. <laughs> I'd rather not. Yeah, so I'm, I'm going to try to go through Morty to answer your question, James, as well. I'm going to try to go through Morty for this. Oh, let me get the items. A full run, it usually takes me about four and a half hours. Four to four and a half, depending on how much uh, speed up is going on, to get to the Elite Four. And then Kanto takes another five and a half on top of that. Although it'll probably take me a little bit more to look for stuff, since it's not in my brain, since I haven't been there since... New Year's Eve. <laughs> I want to get back. So to pop from that is good. I think it's much better to uh, go to that route to restock rather than walking all the way up through Ecruteak. Seems just a little longer. Eh, maybe it's not significant. I could even restock on anything on any wild in Burn Tower. Not sure how bad those will be. It probably won't be too bad. So, not sure what I'm gonna do about those yet. Oh yeah, Bonsley. That was what the other thing I wanted to try. Just gotta be careful not to proc that Dumble. Soda!
Yeah, the old rod could be nice. And it's also closer to a lot of locations. So I should probably just go grab it anyways, yeah. It is closer. So yeah, let's go grab that. Yeah, level 15. Much nicer, especially the further we go. Unless something has fucking Endeavor, you know? <laughs> Isn't that wonderful? True, yeah, you don't have to walk for grass. I can just turn. It's slightly annoying to do with the frame unlimiter. The frame unlimiter kind of sucks for that, but I mean, I can still do it. I get it. I thought I might have pressed B on him. Get this guy out of here! Parish song, bitch. <laughs> I don't know its fourth move either, so I can't predict what the AI is going to like prioritize if it does have a fourth move that the AI likes. I don't know. I kind of want to know its fourth move. Nope, we're getting set up to go to the burn tower right now. Nope, this is the only smooch I'm here. It's gonna be not too bad to get to Chuck because of the old rod. The old rod will make getting to Chuck not too bad, I think. Because you can fish while you're surfing. Let's see if this is okay to do it on. Slap. Poison. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. That's funny, dude. That's fucking awesome. Friend, <laughs> we found another one. Unreal. <laughs> oh, buddy, that's awesome. So now we have one there, we don't have to go all the way back down. Screw you, Smoochum, thanks for helping me out at first. Alright, uh, and then... I don't need the Lepa here. For some recycle. There's no reason to save state. In case I do need to, the tracker's doing it every five minutes for me. Crash, yeah. Okay, so AI likes taunt, I suppose? Hmm, or that. It appears that our Fampy has gone into a Nidoking, which loves to spam kin Kinesis and has extreme bulk. Special attack? Kinda bad. Okay. Mildly annoying for now. We'll see what moves it learns. Ooh, that's kind of gnarly. Not a huge fan of you. I'm gonna lose the Persim here, or Aleppa, whichever one. Or we could Max Ether, maybe. Uh, which one should I take here? It's 
kind of unfortunate. I don't really want to lose it. I probably shouldn't have done that. I should have just done the other trainers. That was kind of a throw. Ball stall? It's not going to use it again, though. Ether, it's not worth it, I think. Do I really have to do this for a person berry? Okay. Wanna yoink my person with covet? Well, actually, I mean, I'm just gonna get rid of it. I'm gonna get rid of all the PP. Covet would have taken it. <laughs> I'm gonna be out of recycle. So then we can start Lepa, but I don't need to. I don't need to. We're just in burn tower. Oh shh. It's just fucking stupid. On a hop it, what am I doing? What am I doing, brother? I'm worried it's gonna take itself out too. Maybe its last move is Memento or something. And it might like have equal priority with that and confuse Ray, making me lose my person. Ugh, come on. Yep, Kaizo. This is Kaizo, guys. Peak Kaizo content right here. The things I will do to make this run work do include this right here. Dun, 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 dun. I wonder why it's going for Covet. Last move could be an HP heal. Could be Memento. Excuse me. Alright, interesting priority. Ah, fuck. I should've... What did I do there? Why did it... I couldn't have gotten it back, though, without healing it, right? Because I would have just killed it. Did I need it to kill itself with the with, uh, struggle? I messed it up anyways. <laughs> Damn it! Aw, oh, you stupid gamer. I should probably just max E through here. I'm not going to make a mistake like that again, I think. Or do I need the max E through? Yeah, I mean, the max E, like, this... I don't think I'll need this. No, I need, I need my Lepas just in case. Cause just in case I mess up with a Lepa, I need a backup. Is Ether worth the berry? Yeah, because I'm a physical attacker. If I get swaggered, having the person is super nice, and I know I have two of them, but okay. Yeah, I think a max Ether is worth a conversion to a person. Even if I still have another person and it's a, it's an infinite resource technically. If I don't mess up my numbers like that, of course I did. Yeah, I, I needed to ball stall throughout that whole thing. That was dumb. But that was I, like, how are you gonna think about that? <laughs> how are you gonna think about that ahead of time? This is so hard. <laughs> uh. So. Dark Void? Oh, I see. <laughs> I didn't think about that probability. Oh, right, I have no accuracy either. Okay. That was dumb, but I kept it. Why? I goofed, gamers. Gamer goof. <laughs> you have gunk shot? Where are you located, my fine fellow? 
Where are you located on this fine evening? Where may I where might I find one fine Rhyhorn specimen with gunk shot? <laughs> yeah, successful fight, not totally successful, but Person berries are way, way harder to find than uh, max ethers are. Because you can get max ethers out of all of the rock smashes. So. One is a likely resource, the other is not. Save state every now and then. Guard spec's nice, especially with a with a more stally mon like this. Guard spec would would be pretty good. Had to think about that one. It's like, what the hell do I do now? I foregore. Yeah, <laughs> I like I like that I was bullied by a hop if That was that was good. If not, if anything else, we can at least talk about that. Hop it strikes back. This better not be like a five percent chance or something. It was Suicune, was it really? Was it really? <laughs> That's fucked. Okay, we're gonna need to find something new to stall on on the next route, I think. Access the water, right? Is it worth 20, 20 HP? Yeah, uh, we should be okay. Commit to this one. Okay, <laughs> lighthouse time. While light, while lighthouse, while poisoned. I don't think I've ever done this while poisoned before. Great. 
I'm a fan. Oh, it's also faster, okay. That's kind of a bad exchange. Dude, what? What? <laughs> They're everywhere. It's just wish caches everywhere. Oh, what the heck is going on? It's all- oops, all whisk cash. I'm gonna steal wing as many things as I can, safely. Oh my god. One HP, you can't do that to me, man. Fuck you. Oh, buddy. Why am I so scared of a speed tie? The game would do it to me, right? It would do it, wouldn't it? I- there's a 91, one speed. It's a legendary, it's not out of the question. Has a lot of HP and defense, it's not out of the question though. Yes, failed attack counts. Failed attack counts. Why is it doing that? Just use your last one, man. Okay, thank you. Just in case, man. I will take no f fucking chances here. The speed tie losing this run? I would- I'd be- I- Uh-uh. Not when we can prevent it. <laughs> I'm not dealing that. Not doing that. No, you get this shit out of here. Why is he throwing out D-Bond, Parish Song? Are you kidding? He really is throwing all this out. That really is being thrown out. That really just happened. I just got Parish Song and D-Bond thrown at me in the same fight. Unreal. Yeah, okay. There's another one of these. Nice crit. This feels awesome, by the way. Doing lighthouse, lighthouse with, with uh, with poison heal while poisoned. I I've never done this before, because before I didn't have Lepa Berry Recycle to like get me here. That's so cool. This is definitely like the only time I ever get to do this. Because normally I would ball stall to get poisoned, without having something like recycle, and then the Lepa Berry. Recycle combo on top of that is really cool. And this thing is annoying. Uh, I think it was bad special attack? I don't remember. Oh no. Okay, so it's good special attack. Okay, so we just get rid of this. Well, thankfully I can't be burnt, because that's fucked. <laughs> oh, it's fast. Right. Good. I have wit, yeah. I have indeed. Megan. This one has Sandstream. Megan's kind of a problem. It's really large in attack. Really large in attack. Defense, low HP. It's kind of an issue for me. A little bit of a scary mon if it gets anything bad. Ah, you like to crit a lot, game. That's still plus. Equal that, equal that. Uh, 
That's fine. So many things with Sandstream, man. Come on. Oh, it's faster than hell. Stab, gunk shot, too. Wow, that's super fast. Alright, we're good. Morty's up next, and we will be poisoned for Morty's gym, which is huge. Really, really big. Yo, Powder. <laughs> I mean, we have a lot of status heals, man. Like, a lot, a lot, a lot. I would be preferential to some more hyper pots and max pots now. We'll get some super repels going, just to have them. Because I ran out of regular repels. Okay, so, let's do the Morty Pred. For any late night... Mori? <laughs> For any early morning, late night gamblers, this should be a really enjoyable prediction. I'll give you two minutes, because we're going to go set up poison. Yep, exactly, Whip. No, that's yeah, that's what that's what I'm doing. I mean, twin needle technically is better. It's easier to get poisoned off of, but whatever. The Bonsley is not an issue. So two minutes to gamble. Will I beat Morty? We got three hundred and eighty-six thousand on yes. That or payout of one to five hundred. <laughs> Buy more balls for ball stall. Yeah, probably. Well, ball stall doesn't use up balls. Unless I'm throwing it at a wild, so that would be... unlikely. Unless it uses taunt. That's the only time I would do that, and then I have to catch and release it. So, just in case it uses taunt. I have like 25, though. And yeah, just to be stocked up, though, I suppose. We'll have 69 balls. Nice. Perfect. 69 balls. Okay, 96% believe, 4% doubt. In we go. Is there anything I need? Slow start extreme speed moment. This thing sucks. Scary. I don't like super tanky mons that also set up, especially high BST like Arcanine, because it could actually make it really sketch.
God, that thing is so fast. Okay, Mort. Give me your worst shot. <laughs> funny. Annoying, but also funny. Probably heal bait here. No? Okay, that's fine. Secondary comes out. Blah. Alright, I don't need to do anything in particular here. You can just spam Steel Wings or Pokemon, it doesn't matter. Okay, we'll call that equal attack. Good defense. This will definitely be heal bait. Pretty low HP as well. We'll get that right back though, don't worry. On this turn right here. Ace out third, not my favorite thing to see. Stuck in uproar, we'll be fine to steel wing here. Just to conserve on PP. In the worst case, this will be a heal. Oh, it's stuck in uproar, right? <laughs> I just said that, dummy. Okay. Pretty bad, but we can get through it. Get through that. We out heal both those. Everything is a giga tank. And now we'll get the heal out of it, out of Morty. It does have two heals. He won't use the other one till the last mon. Send out something like a frickin' Heatran or some shit. Worried about Heatran the most. This team is frickin' ridiculous, by the way. Dragonite, Kingdra, fucking dude, Swampert. Espequin isn't that bad, but like grotesque Pokemon. They weren't all shit. <laughs> I'm gonna... Oh, wait, no, he's gonna heal here, so... I was gonna say I was gonna ball stall this if he... Tailwind outspeeds Destiny Bonds me. Ah, yes. <laughs> yes, dude. Razor Leaf? It's coverage. It's kind of... Kind of weird. Able, of course. Ugh, it's not steel coverage. But it gives me water. Ground and rock. All of which I don't have. Oh, I have rock with steel. Is it worth it? Uh, probably. It's probably worth it. 
Grand Water versus nothing with Slash, but it's a bunch of neutral, which is what I'm, like, depending on, because my attack isn't massive. Less power, less act, good coverage, though. Still a lot of PP. High, still high crit rate, too. <laughs> uh... I wish I had, like, if I had a PP max, it'd be really easy, because I would do it on Night Slash, or PP ups. Yeah, Steel Wing is okay, neutral as well, and anything except for fire that it doesn't hit would be neutral. With Razor Leaf. We have to keep Slash. Um... Why? I don't see... I don't see why. 95 Ack is so annoying, but, like, we heal each turn, so... Firefighting? Oh. Shit. Yeah, that sucks. Oh. Well, we've seen Infernape. Infernape has really low HP, but I crit it, so I don't know anything else about it. I have not seen Blaziken. Probably not. Uh, so yeah, that is tough. I mean, I can I can hold on to it for now. I wish I could learn these. God damn it! <laughs> oh, fudge! Give me these, dude. <laughs> That's so dumb. Pluck over Steel Wing and then Razor Leaf. Come on. Yes, I did, Queen. Wake up, slap. Ah. Just give me these. What are you talking about? Razor Lee, 5595. Yeah, that's tough. Firefighting is bad then. Really bad at that. I probably didn't need to do that, but whatever. I was I was thinking that I was going to be done. <laughs> Cause I'm tired. And it was bit and it's been a great stream so far. Would I definitely want to keep this thing going? I mean I'm making four save states for it, four different ones. I wanna keep this thing going on the next stream. Keep this thing going on Shut up, gamer. I want to. I want to, I want to, I want to. So let's raid Outrix, because I don't get to raid him unless he is ending. Let me see. I want to raid him. Okay, good. He's actually Oh, what? He got a flash fire Caesar? Dude! Yeah, we're definitely raiding out. That's so stupid. Oh. He's got follower only chat, but if you're following Outrix already, go ahead and send him a wowie. Or a wowie boy. Bonds that poison me are Smoochum on 31 and Bonsley on 38 or 7, whatever this one is. Right below at Critique. I'm not gonna forget them, probably. Yeah, okay, so we're gonna raid Alex. Join me on the raid. Uh, he is eight and a half hours into his heart gold soul silver stream, so we're gonna keep it going. <laughs> and I will continue this next stream. Join Discord. Uh, or make sure you follow the stream here to make sure that you can keep up with whenever I do go live, if in fact it is not tomorrow or the day after. I will have this ready whenever I do get back to it, but just in case it's not the next couple days, for whatever reason, because weather does what weather does, it's unpredictable in some senses, whether I'll need to be focused on it, on my job, versus this. Make sure you keep up with that in whatever way you want to, because, yeah, I wouldn't want to miss this run. All right, send some stuff to to Arix, who is doing Heart Gold Soul Silver Kaizo, and enjoy your mornings. Thanks for sticking with me till 5 a.m. Goodness! Goodbye. I look forward to this. Thanks for all the support, too.